Hello and welcome back to the channel everybody we got some unfinished business now you might be wondering what the heck I'm talking about here but we are back on PS2 football and we're going back to where it all began folks Mississippi State Bulldogs baby NCAA football 2003 the series is returning Hopefully you guys are excited for this. I know it's been a very long time since I've done any kind of football or any streaming really. But got a computer, got the PS2 hooked up, we're ready to go. And you know, the unfinished business part is, you know, this series was a lot of fun. We did five seasons for this, uh, like we do uh, most of our series. If I can get this correct here. There we go, there it is. So, we went 1-4 in bowl games with Mississippi State. And, uh, we're, you know, that's just not okay. So, <laughs> we got to fix that. We got to figure out the problem there. Of course, our, our only victory uh, in the, the bowl seasons was our national championship victory over UCF, which was, of course, uh, just an absolute classic game. But I, I want to get back to the series. I haven't played 03 since, well, since our last game of the series. I haven't picked it up since. I've been playing a little bit of 04 and some 07 here and there. Trying to get the old fingers working uh, the way that they need to. So, let's see. We are, we were 50 and 18 in the five seasons that we played. Uh, let me know if the sound is alright guys, if you can hear me, if the game audio is too loud, I will adjust it as we go. But we are currently in the off season here. Just give me one moment. Still trying to remember how to do <laughs> try to do OBS. Okay. Should be okay now. Alright, there's our record. 50 and 18 in five seasons. Coach Prestige, a big old fat six stars. That's gonna help us out here in recruiting. We just went nine and four. You know, we lost another bowl game. It was a heartbreaker, 27-25 against Colorado. Of course, we haven't played this game in uh, what, five years, I think. Well, this is where it all began. This is where the channel started. This helped us help get us to a thousand subscribers. Uh, let's see, we had a long, long winning streak of twenty. Five winning seasons, of course. Only won the SEC one time, and only one national championship. All right. Well. Uh, let's see, we'll take a look back at who won the national championship here. I do remember that this should have been the national championship game. Uh, they were both undefeated going into the game, and somehow Oklahoma with one loss and Fresno State with one loss got into the championship game. And, I mean, Oklahoma's not the champs. It's Illinois. They went 13-0. They were number two. They should have been in there. But we're going to get into the offseason and uh, get some guys, you know? Make sure my chat is working properly, too. Jay Balmer in the chat. B Sizzle. What up, B Dog? How you doing? All right. Players leaving. Yeah, let's let's do that. Let's uh, let's see. Can we look at our our rosters here? All right. So here is the roster. Yeah, we want Colorado. You're right. Oh my goodness. Come on, baby. My goodness gracious. There we go. Okay, so Napoleon Watson is our quarterback. Five touchdowns, seven picks. 
Now, I think we did roll with Jeff Terry, actually, uh, last season as well. Over 2,100 passing yards, 15 touchdowns. Jay Ballmer still met it. Uh, that Florida State's not in the playoffs. I'm not upset about it. It's okay. See, we've got Jamar Dalton. We've got to utilize his speed next season. 96 speed, boys. We got some talent. All right, I know that. We are going to lose some guys, though. For sure. No one losing Antoine Finch. Really sucked. He was hurt for the bowl game. We need a kicker. Mike Randall's leaving. Randall had a really good season, or a really good career, rather. Uh, last season was his worst. I gotta, I haven't worked on kicking at all. Uh, we're just gonna get into the off season here, and then we're gonna play some games, of course. For season six, here's our players leaving. John Pena. I don't know if you guys remember him or not. He was part of our first ever draft class. He had a good sophomore season, five touchdowns, and kind of fell off a little bit. Six drops in his junior year, a little bit rough there, no touchdowns as well. Uh, Neil Nelson, fantastic career for him as well. And outside linebacker, Antoine Finch, he had a good career. Big season this year, three picks. Uh, but he got hurt. Jeremy Tate, senior corner, is leaving. Uh, let's see, yeah, I think he got hurt, if I remember correctly. Michael Glar, best DB in the nation, seven picks. And Mike Randall, of course. All right, so we're going to let these guys go. We're going to export the draft class. Because, well, who knows? Maybe maybe we'll go back to Madden 03 sometime. I don't know. I'm leaving everything open. That's what I try to do for all the series. Do, 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 do. For some reason, I can't pull up my chat on OBS. I'm not sure what's going on there. Why is that? Why, oh why? Oh well, stream's going good. We're only using 7% of the computer. No drop frames. We're killing it, guys. We're absolutely killing it right now. All right. Let's let these guys leave. Can we let them leave? Can I do that? Okay. How do we do that? All right, we're just going to go to the next thing. Recruiting. Go get some big-time talent. and a kicker. Still interested prospects here. Yep, we're going to add you. Hold on, let's see. What do we got here? Hey, what are you doing, huh? 4640? Okay. Alright, we're going to add all these guys. We'll add more points into them as we go. But for now, what's this guy got? Fi okay, he's a pocket passer. Uh, should we go after him? Yeah, might as well. Why not? Okay. Kicker. Let's go over to Kicker, see what we got. Uh, he wants to just play for us immediately, so... And it helps. He's from Mississippi. Hometown kid. Okay. That's what I'm talking about, baby. Should we go after him just in case? Yeah, we'll go after him just in case. Alright. Let's go on defense here. Through safety, we're number one on his list. Corner. 
Middle linebacker. Oh, he's from Mississippi. We've got to get him. We're going to play eight points into him. And we have a lot of points to use here, so. Like I said, I'll go back through and add more to everybody. Eight summers. Can never have enough linebackers. You tackle. Do, do, do. Okay. This lineman. Tight end. We definitely need a tight end. We just lost Pena. Boys from Mississippi coming out. Okay. What do you got? Oh, man. You guys are slow dirt. Oof. That is unfortunate for you. What this guy? 4 3 40. Excellent hands. Love to see that. 4 7 5 40. Oops. Okay. We're going to go after one fullback here. Ike Carter. Alright, nobody else is really interested that much. I mean, we might as well go after the punter as well, right? I mean, we got a freshman. Just off, on the off chance we don't get one of the kickers. We got 21 targets right now. Okay. Alright, so. Let's see. What do we want to go after here? Look at Oklahoma going after all these five star quarterbacks. That is ridiculous. Look for a speedy guy here. Average arm strength? David, come on, man. I don't know if we're going to be getting any mobile quarterbacks. Now, nah. Alright, so. Trying to look at the roster here. 21 targets. Where do we need the most help? I'm going to go look at some of these guys. If we got high interest, I'm going to go after them. Never have enough help at running back. quarterbacks like Pokemon. Come on, man. Alright, I don't think we're going to have that either. Alright, check out receivers. UTEP. This guy's got UTEP as his number one. Leon Townsend. 6'5", 203 pounds. I mean, we're going after him. I don't care. That's a big, big boy. Roy Benton. That's a big boy, too. My goodness. 6'4", 214. I like the small receivers too, but I mean, it's, it's just going to help to have these big guys we can throw to. Why would this guy want to go to Syracuse? I can't remember if they're good or not <laughs> in this series, but that's fine. Alright, we got one more offer we can give. I'm going to go after a center. Okay, there he is. Rich Hampton, Waterbury, Vermont. We're doing it. All right, let's look at our targets. We'll go back through and we'll give them all, just all the points because we have 331 to use. We'll give this receiver a bunch as well. I forgot in this game you can give more than one call. 
in one visit. It's a beautiful thing. See how many of these bad boys we can get. Good thing about you know how well we did in the first five seasons is you know our coach prestige is just through the roof. So that's gonna draw a lot of recruits our way. Alright, that's it. We have 25 targets, only two needs, but I'm sure we'll get them. I targeted four outside linebackers as well as two middle linebackers, so if we don't get one of those two middle linebackers. I'm, I'm sure we're going to get some outside linebackers to fill that spot that we do need. We're going to get a kicker, 100%. All right. Let's see what we got. Pretty excited about this series making a return. Been wanting to play it again for quite some time. All right, so far our stream is holding very nicely, and that is just glorious. All right, so we got a middle linebacker. We already filled that need, and we got a tight end. So we already filled the hole left by John Pena. Very nice. So, Alan Campbell, four-star middle linebacker out of Hammond, Louisiana. And three-star tight end Mark Lawrence out of, what is that? What is that? Beaverville? I'm guessing. I don't know. We're just winging it here. All right, did we lose anybody? All right, so a couple guys committed elsewhere. One tight end went to Syracuse. Solomon Wong, which is kind of crazy. Four-star receiver went to Ohio State. And we are number one on a lot of teams here. We're on a lot of players. Gonna keep giving these guys all the points. No, I'm doing this pretty quick here. Alright, I think for the guys that were already number one, we're just going to give them that top option. That way we can save some points for other positions that we need to fill. Oh, wow, that guy. Yeah, that's not going to be too many points. No way this guy's gonna go to Louisiana Tech, right? There ain't no way. Come on, man. Alright, kicker, we need you. We need just one of you guys to join us, please. Please. Come on, man. Be tackle, we're not even on the list yet. Alright, let's pull back. Okay. Can offer two more guys here. Cook State prospects. Yeah, why not? And what about this guy? All right, we'll go after him. Oh, we're already going after him. All right, cool. Sit. And a center. Sure. Go back through. We got 26 points left over. 12 points. And that's it. I forgot how quick and easy the uh, recruiting is in this game. Look at our team perceived. We got five stars out of six. If we had more bowl wins, we would be a six star school right now, but we've only won one bowl game out of five seasons. So we we really gotta work on that.
that's our motto for this series going forward. It's unfinished business. All right, we won one national championship, and I feel like that's just not enough. Okay, we got quarterback, Joe Parrish, five-star quarterback out of St. Cloud, Florida. We got four-star linebacker Jake Blankenship out of Arkadelphia, Arkansas. Left outside linebacker. Rick Hayes, we got our kicker. We got both of those kickers. Oh my. We got Marvin Kennedy at free safety. And Carl Salazar, middle linebacker out of South Haven, Mississippi. Okay. We only got seven scholarships left. Who did we lose out on here? All right, wide receiver went to UTEP. Five-star, number one receiver in the country, UTEP. Eh, yeah, okay. That makes sense. Rob Sawyer went to Tennessee. Five-star middle linebacker, or outside linebacker, went to Southern Miss. Okay. Five-star center to Syracuse. Four-star center to Louisiana Tech. Four-star left tackle to TCU. And four-star D tackle to Florida. We got 10 targets left, only 7 scholarships. Sure would be nice to get him, but we're not going to get him. So we're going to withdraw that. We could sneak up and get him, possibly. We can just get all these guys, but we just don't have a lot of scholarships. I think it's what, 15 per season? I think. I have no idea. I can't remember. My brain is potato. Well, we already filled the positions of need. Alright, we got our middle linebacker because we got two commits. And we got two pickers, so I think we're doing all right. All right, so eight commits, got nine targets. All right, what do we got here? Week on, that's tough. Guy anyway. Five eleven, and you can't run. That is unfortunate. I'm trying to see if we can't get anybody else. Looking at the roster, we need more corners for sure. That guy has no interest. What is with Syracuse getting all these guys? Going after him. Why not? Doesn't hurt. I mean, some of these guys are probably slow. Never mind. All these guys are running 4 twos. Okay. Sick dude. This guy is 6-1. He's running 4-4. Four, four. Not fast enough for my liking. Sorry. That guy's only 5-9. Yeah, why not? I'm off for three more guys. Try to get some D-line help, maybe. I would like another lineman as well, but... It's been pretty hard to get offensive line and D-line from what I can remember about this series and this game. Alright, let's see what we do.
four guys. Five star outside linebacker Corbin May. We got five star safety Jared Woodard. Four star tight end John Anderson. And we got the punter Bubba Grimes from Dallas, Texas. Let's see what we lost out on here. Oh my goodness gracious. A lot of guys signed. I got went to Fresno State, Colorado, Syracuse, Tennessee, Tennessee, Southern Miss getting a lot of five stars, which is insane. Okay, so far, we've got what, 12 commits? Okay. Four targets. All right. It's going to be tough. Do, do, do. Okay. Can go after some guys that are interested, but there's not really a lot of big names there. Big talent. Man, Colorado snagging all these good players. Trying to find excellent hands and a good 40 time. That's pretty good, but he's very small. also small. You know what? Heck with it. It doesn't hurt to go after him. I mean, what's the worst thing that happens if we don't get him? Okay. Excellent hands. 4-4-40. Four, four, about this guy? No, nope, not good enough. Four hands at receiver and you're short. Oh my goodness. 41640? What? Please. Like, what are you talking about? This poor soul is running a 4-7. Wow. running backs. See if we can't find a gem in here somewhere. 4940 at halfback. Wow. Nah, nobody's running fast enough. See if we can't find a gem at corner maybe? These guys are all four stars. Let's go down to the three stars here. Pick a gander. Oh, okay, that's insane. Kill Devil Hills, North Carolina. Yes, sir. All right, we'll go after him. Just hoping to get some like late commits. Some guys we, you know, otherwise wouldn't be looking at. Four two forty. Not the greatest, but that's okay. Any fast linebackers here? Got a four six seven, and that is the fastest. Oh goody! Four six three. Any tackles? Anybody? Uh, nothing really exciting here on the D line, huh? That guy's pretty good. Okay. Go after him. I don't really know who else to go after here. Sure. Just gonna throw some scholarships at some linemen here. Why not? Take a shot, you know. We 
We've already got a really good recruiting class anyway, so. Okay, we're going after these guys already. And that will be it for week four. Let's see if we can't get anybody. really unfortunate. Not going to have a big recruiting class, I guess. Well, to be fair, we only have, what, 13 seniors, 12 juniors. We had a big class last season, 17 sophomores there. We got a bunch of points we could throw at people right at the end. See what's out there still. Left guard, sure. See, this is where I, I really like this game is because you can just throw points at guys right at the end, and you might get some. Four six forty. Stop it. Get some help. Excellent hands for fullback. Okay. Four six. That's terrible. Outside linebacker. I mean, we've already we've got a crap ton of linebackers. Who needs players? <laughs> I, I mean, we already we got some good ones, you know. guy could be a monster. We don't really need anything else. We could always use O-line, but I don't think there's many O-line left. Some three stars. Yeah, why not? Let's go after all the three stars. Take my points. Six foot four at corner. Walton. Now nah, we don't need a free safety. We don't really need anything anymore, honestly. But this guy. Throw some points at another quarterback. Why not? Got one more scholarship. Anybody quick? Yeah, sure. There you go, buddy. Take the points. Alright, see if we get anybody here. Wick Billions! What's going on, buddy? Watching Nova and using them on 11. Nice. Took out Northwestern. I mean, that's, that's an easy decision, honestly. Good luck to you, sir. Hope you get many conference championships. so rusty at this game. I'm 
scared. Like I said at the start of the stream, I, I've played a, I've been trying to practice 04 and I was playing some some 07s, but two completely different games. And not like this one. I mean, 04 is close, but more refined. Alright, so we got a three-star halfback out of nowhere and uh, another four-star quarterback. A last name that I can't pronounce. Awesome. Alright, look at our targets. We'll get rid of the guys that signed elsewhere. We'll go from there. Not a big class. We got 14 commits, though. Not terrible. I don't believe we've ever gotten 25 commits. But here it is. Here's the class. We got two three stars. And a boatload of four stars. And three five star players. One a strong safety. Jared Woodard. And Corbin May at right upside linebacker. And Joe. Parish out of St. Cloud, Florida. Um, yeah, that's not bad. Not bad at all, guys. I mean, that linebacker, 4 5 40 is almost as fast as a strong safety. That's impressive. Take a look at the top classes here. We got number eight in the country going into season number six. Tennessee, you got 12 five stars. 12. You gotta be kidding me. Here's our offensive leaders from last season and defensive leaders. George Tyler, 58 tackles. Not bad, not bad. Hawkins had a great year, 1128 yards, six touchdowns. If I remember right, he uh, dropped a two-point conversion in our bowl game to, uh, you know, help us lose that one against Colorado. Not sure how many games we're going to play here today, but... It's going to be a few, at least. I have a Red Bull. I'm not afraid to drink it. I'm doing it right now. Yeah, I got a little worried today when I turned this game on. Because it got frozen on the screen that was checking memory cards when the game was loading. And I was like, oh man, if I reset this game right now and it deletes my Bulldogs dynasty, I'm gonna lose my mind. And luckily, uh, nothing happened, so. Crisis averted. Take a look at the training results, shall we? All right, uh, yeah. Look at the quarterbacks. Napoleon Watson, I believe. Oh my. Cletus. Don't make me get the hose. Yeah, we have a lot of slow uh, slow quarterbacks. We have Jeff Terry. Uh, we did end up using him last season, but I don't know. Maybe we'll use Watson this year a little bit more. I mean, he's got a great arm. If I can look at his ratings. Where the heck is his throw power? 88 throw power, 83 accuracy. Terry can't throw the ball as well. Uh, let's see. Running backs. Dalton. 79 overall. we got to get him in the open field. Got to do it. Alex Acosta. What's going on, man? Glad to see you, buddy. Fullback. Oh, my goodness gracious. Kenny Harding went up seven points for his overall. We got ourselves a fullback. Running backs that went up the most. I mean, Robbie Ballard trying to take that starting spot. He's just a little bit slow, though. He's going to be our bruiser. You know, and we need short yardage. You know, we're on the goal line. That's He's our guy. All right, we'll separate this from overall here. All right, so yeah. By overall, here's the uh, position groups. See, Ballard is actually rated higher than Dalton by a slight margin there. Alright, receivers, Ron Hawkins, 85 overall, pretty quick. Kevin Davis, quick as well. Orlando Webb, Thomas Roy, and then uh, Lee Brown, who had a touchdown last season. 
Now we gotta remember that this game does not count the uh, bowl game stats as well. So there's stats missing, but that's okay. All right, tight end room is a little slim right now. We did get a commit though. Left tackle, we're gonna need a tackle for next season. Left guard is a senior as well. We got a lot of upperclassmen here on the O line, and that is unfortunate because I don't think we really got any any lineman recruits that I can remember. We have a couple young guys here though. Rock Contreras up to an 82, trying to take that starting spot from Roman McCray. Our team's looking pretty good. Look at the D tackle spot. I mean, my goodness. Pretty dang good. Everybody in the 80s. Love to see that. Outside linebackers. Middle linebackers a little weak. Dennis Garcia. Derek McCarthy, 75 overalls. Cornerbacks are pretty decent. Joe Grimes, Frank Stanton. Good old George Tyler. Look at his career. He's fallen off since that sophomore season, but or freshman season rather. But hopefully you can come back, have a really good senior campaign. Do 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 do. All right, Dwayne Barry. Yeah, Reed. No kicker. Punter only went up two. All right, so that is it for training results. Let's see if we have to cut anybody. I don't remember. Uh, how many we have on the roster at the moment? Whoopi Goldberg used to be a dishwasher before she became famous. That's pretty cool. All right, uh, don't think we have to cut anybody. Okay, 55. Okay, that's the roster. I can't remember. All right, let's see what we got here. William Luna. I mean, you're probably never gonna play there, bud. Yeah, 74 throw power. Mr. Luna, I regret to inform you that your career is over before it ever began. True freshman quarterback, Joe Parrish. What? 80 overall? Okay. He's got some work to do, though. Got some good freshmen right there. I like that. And Terry is just completely buried on the depth chart. We're keeping him there, though. We're not going to cut him. Man, there's just no speed at that back except for Dalton. That's so tough. I like how our fullback is faster than three of our running backs. Tight end. A true freshman is our best tight end, John Anderson. That is crazy. Tackles. We're not going to cut any tackles. Or guards. I'm keeping all the O-line. Defensive ends. We've only got three. Two tackles are all really good. Outside linebackers. True freshman up at the top right there. Corbin May. He's definitely going to be a starter with that 80 speed. That's ridiculous. We're going to have to start Singleton on that left side. He only four tackles last season, so he hasn't done a whole lot in his career. He's going to get that opportunity this season, though. All right. Who the heck are we going to cut? we got to cut a lot. I know we got a bunch of kickers here. Gonna redshirt Kennedy this season. Dwayne Barry. You know what, Dwayne? I'm sorry. He's gone. We're gonna start Jared Woodard with the 88 speed. Get some speed back there. Alright, kickers. 62 speed? Okay. I like that. Kick power, kick accuracy. We're gonna have to cut. Patterson. Sorry. You weren't good enough. Bubba Grimes. Man, 
and he just doesn't have the kick power. We're going to leave him for now. Go back to him. Alright. He's a retreat freshman or lower on the depth chart. Yeah, that's usually what I try to do. Or, you know, guys that just aren't going to get playing time, really. Cletus? Did he even play it? I don't know yet. Oh, that's right. He's a redshirt. Okay. We're going to have to get rid of some running backs here. Uh, let's see. going to get rid of Saunders. Keep four for now. Do we have to have, I can't remember if we had to have two fullbacks or not. Yep, okay. Wide receivers, tight ends. Man, Jensen, you've done absolutely nothing. I think I'm going to get rid of Jensen. Yep, sorry. Got to make some tough cuts here in this game. you got to get your roster down to 55. Really tough guys. <laughs> Jeez. I'm gonna give it a Sutton. The senior, he's not gonna play. Going real young at linebacker now. I'm gonna give it to McCarthy. All right, we still. Well, what are we at? We gotta give it to one more guy. He's probably gonna be the punter. I can find somebody else. We need five quarterbacks, guys. Brandon Plaster, what's going on, brother? Preach the greatness of Levi, Levi. <laughs> Levi, swear, baby. What a legend. I'm going to get her a quarterback here. Unfortunately, I, it's looking like Cletus Pace, to be honest. No, I can't give her to Cletus. I can't. I also don't want to get rid of Jeff Terry because, I mean, he did decent for us last season. He had some rushing yards, 611, three touchdowns. I might start him. I don't, oh, man, I don't know. Yeah, 55-man roster, I, it's so tough, guys. Like, it's, <laughs> it might be the most difficult part about this game is, you know, each offseason deciding, you know, which one of my once coveted recruits I want to, get rid of, you know, in the moment. It's so difficult. I think I'm going to get rid of a defensive tackle here because we have so many that are all really good, but... Oh, man, it's so tough. It's like, should I get rid of another, like, upperclassman or maybe a freshman that's not going to play any, any snaps, you know? Oh, man, I need some corners. I should have... I was really hoping to get some in the offseason, but it just didn't happen. Man. All right, what are we looking at for catch here? What do we got? Now, these guys are pretty good. It's like, I don't want to get rid of these guys in case Tyler gets hurt. Dang. All right, we're going to have to get rid of Bubba Grimes, I think, even though he's got a really great name, you know? Maybe quarterback. I don't know. Why is it so difficult? All right, you can't throw. I'm sorry. All right, I got to keep the punter. That's just who I am. I got to do it. No, I don't want to cut him. All right. <laughs> I had to keep the punter, guys. His name's Bubba. It had to be done. gracious do, 
do 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 well the stream is just holding so beautifully right now I love it all right depth chart more tough decisions here all right Parrish you're gonna get that guy in my face right now I think we started Watson at the beginning of last season and it didn't work out too well and then we moved to Terry but I think I'm gonna try to roll with Watson he's just got a better arm he's got no stamina whatsoever though that's really unfortunate Tyler Rocky what's going on Tyler what's up buddy okay halfbacks are good fullbacks I mean that's a, just a nasty fullback guys my goodness tight end two freshmen really young tight end group We need O line in the next off season. For show. For show. Alright, so let's see. Freshman and senior, blah blah blah. There's so many upperclassmen. We got a really good O line, I think. It's not bad. Defensive ends are pretty good. Now here's a question. Do I start Contreras? Or McCray? Well McCray started last season to get a single sack. So, I think we're going to give Contreras the nod here. I mean, they're almost identical players. Uh, Contreras has slightly better stamina, and McCray has better injury. So, I don't know. I don't know if any of it's going to make any difference. Maybe that five speed will be a difference maker, and he'll be able to make some plays. I don't know. We only have three defensive events. That is... Unfortunate. Michigan in the playoffs for a third time in a row. Are they going to lose for a third time in a row, Tyler? Or are they going to actually do something this season? Just curious, you know. Alright, let's see. Another linebacker. we got a lot of young guys out here. I don't know if I want to start Blankenship here or not. Agility is trash. My god. Yeah, I'll, we're going to start Singleton. I think he gives us a better chance here. I was thinking of going like youth movement, get all these freshmen out on the field right now, you know? Corner. Not bad there. And I'm starting Woodard. True freshman at strong safety, fellas. So watch out for that spot during the season. Alright, kick return. I'm not having George Tyler on kick return. Are you out of your mind? Defender out there. There's just nobody. That would give Woodard a shot. Why not? Alright, I'm going to put our kicker out there on kickoff. 62 speed. I'll take it. Be able to try to track somebody down. Whoops. Alright, that's it for the depth chart. Let's get it. Custom schedules. Yeah, I don't think.
think I want to touch the schedule at all, to be honest with you. We have no ranked opponents on the schedule. That is really unfortunate. Yeah, I'm just going to leave that. I haven't played this game in like five years, so <laughs> just bear with me here. Alright, I think I'm going to redshirt Parish. Paul Bear Bryant, you know? I almost wonder if I should redshirt Kenny so I can get Garrett out there. That's what I'm going to do. Okay, we're going to have Kenny for two years. He's going to progress even more and have a 90 overall. Can't redshirt a receiver. Can't really redshirt the tight ends either. Man, this is tough. Left guard, senior, the end, can't redshirt anybody there. Redshirt Cohen. It's another thing about the 55-man roster, you know, you, you really got to be careful with how many people you redshirt, because you might end up just having to burn the redshirt anyway due to injuries or, or just people not playing very well. All right, Bubba Grimes, red shirt, buddy. All right. All right, here we go. For anybody that missed this at the beginning of the stream, we're going into year six. We are 50 and 18. Coach received six stars. And we are one and four in bowl games, so we're we're really trying to correct that because uh, you know I just don't want to lose bowl games anymore. I feel like this is probably, in terms of success, I think this is our our least successful college football series. You know, we got one title, one conference championship, and other than that, I mean, we just can't get it done. So that's the aim for the rebirth of this series and, and that is to get some bowl wins all right let's get it we're probably going to get killed first few games i'm not even going to lie to you i i don't even remember how hard it was i don't know all right syracuse beats michigan uh yeah good job dude you were there you got off the bus i think and that was about it Kansas State beats Rutgers, Oregon beats Maryland, NC State beats Virginia Tech, and Blacksburg, and Hawaii beats Cal. Nice game. Alright. So, what do you have to say to me? Time to make a statement in the poll. Show them your team is for real. I don't even know if we're ranked. What is our ranking here? Okay, so preseason poll, we were ranked 23rd. Okay. We dropped one spot because, well, we didn't play. Do, 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 do. Okay. Okay, okay. Shall we? Here's the matchup. Going to Starkville. Come on, baby. And Southern Miss, obviously, they're pretty good. Uh, you guys saw during the recruiting, they got several four- and five-star recruits. They ranked 31st nationally. And uh, they just won their previous game against Oklahoma State, 21-14. So, yeah, there's that. And this is televised. Do, 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 do. Bam, 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 bam. Okay. Let's make sure we have our profile loaded here. How do I do that? Where am I going?
Actually, at first, we'll uh, save that. How did we get ranked 24th? Well, we were 23rd in the polls, in the preseason polls. But, you know, we didn't play a game, so we dropped down one. But the previous season, uh, we won nine games, so I guess that was good enough for us to get get into those preseason polls. And, you know, they have high expectations for us, as do I. How fast are the quarterbacks we can recruit in this game? Well, I believe there was a couple of quarterbacks that had four, five, or four, six, forties. So, yeah, that's pretty much it, you know? That's about as fast as they get. I, I don't think there's going to be any, um, any quarterbacks with like 90 speed or anything like that. Hopefully, oh, here we go, load profile. Yeah, I'm assuming this is the one. There we go. Okay, we got our profile loaded. And we're also on TV, so where is the audio here? Um, my goodness gracious. Settings, there we go. Alright, so we're on Heisman. We know that. Play by play. Normal. Okay. And then we'll turn them off once we get in there. Let's see. I don't remember... Sliders. Where are the sliders here? Yeah, I don't remember. Oh, yeah. Okay. Yeah, so this should be fun. Now, bear with me, uh, because... <laughs> you know, I can't feel my fingertips all the way, so... This might be a little rough. We're just going to go, you know, we're going to go full maroon. Yeah, speed is definitely a premium in these games, for sure. Now, we had, we had Ken Topps at quarterback. He won the Heisman for us. He was pretty quick. Now, in real life, I believe, you know, he did start out as a quarterback. I believe they switched him to wide receiver. In real life so that's why he was as quick as he was Starkville, Mississippi, and Scott Field, the site for our football contest today and it's gonna be a hot one out here for today's game between the Southern Mississippi Golden Eagles and the Mississippi State Bulldogs and the Mississippi State Bulldogs joined by the coach, Lee Corso, and the quarterback, Kirk Herbstreet. And if it's excitement you're looking for, well, you've come to the right place as the early college football season continues. Kirk, how do you see this? These boys are some ballers. Deadlock. This could go to either team. You know, I think in a game like this, you need to look at the big playmakers. Southern Miss is going to be tested here defensively by this quarterback. Lee, I think they'll lose a close game because of their inability to match up in the secondary and the lack of pressure they'll put on the quarterback. And I'd like to add one thing. Mississippi State is going to win this one because of one reason. Their ability to run the football. That coaching staff has done a nice job of putting together an offensive line that can really open up some holes. Thanks, guys. Looks like we're going to have an action-packed game. So let's get down to the field where they're waiting for the coin toss. Let's go. Action-packed game. Let's get it. I don't even know who they picked, but we're doing it. Uh, let's go on defense first. I'm nervous. All right, we gotta turn the uh, announcers off here. There we go. Beautiful. Oh, 
Oh god. I gotta kick this with like the middle of my finger here. Let's go dogs. Oh boo. Water. Remember using George Tyler. Get him. Wow, five wide receivers set for him. These guys are going to be really tough, I think. Oh, come on, freshman. All right, so Woodard got beat already. That's tough. Showing our youth out there with uh, missed tackling and a blown coverage. Drake was 49 yards passing already on just two attempts. And there we go. First incompletion. Doesn't have position changes? Uh, I don't believe so, no. Now, this. As far as like a lot of the off the field stuff, this game is kind of bare bones, you know? But that's why I, I really like this one and I love 04. You know, it's simplistic, you know, it's nothing nothing too crazy. They just focus on the football. Alright, this is a huge play, third and four. I'm really nervous to go on offense and I, I just can't remember you know what kind of offense we tried to run before it's been so long since I played this series get him boys there we go beautiful help no field goal don't forget to slap the like button guys and subscribe if you need I have a computer now so there will be lots of streams are they going for it Oh boy. Get him. No. Oh my goodness. That was a great run right up the middle. Fullback just goes untouched for 20 yards. Ugh. Disgusting. Alright, let's go 4 4. Man lock. So defense, we had him stopped, you know. Just couldn't couldn't hold my fourth down. Really unfortunate. Get him! Oh, there we go. Good tackle. Ashley Jackson! What's up, girl? How you doing? Glad to see that I'm back. Glad to be back. Truly. I have missed streaming football games so much. <laughs> Like, I was trying to stream other stuff, and it was just, you know, it wasn't my passion, so. Got myself a computer, and we're doing it. Oh, that was definitely over the line. I guess not. All right. But, you know, we got the new computer. Well, not new. It's a refurbished, but, you know, it's working. It's beautiful. So I figured I'd bring back an old series, the one that started the channel off. Oh, Moreno. Oh, man. Dang. Got to go with your passion? Absolutely. Football is just simply the best, you know? And my defense is not, however. We're, we're looking a little rough right now on third and fourth down. But we'll, we'll get there.
Yeah, refurbished. They just put, you know, like somebody sold or something and just put all brand new parts in it. I don't know. Listen, I, I hit the power button and the power works. That's, just <laughs> that's all I care about. Oh, there's holding. Dang. Oh, got him for clipping. That's a great way to start the drive. Starting on our own 13 yard line. We're going to see what works here because I don't have a single clue. Thinking back on the North Carolina Tar Heels dynasty, we threw the ball a lot to short to intermediate routes. See if we can do that here today. Well, that worked well. Hawkins. Nice catch. We can just stick to the short to intermediate passes. I think we'll be okay. And maybe not with the O-line, just not blocking. That's unfortunate. I see what the coach picks for us here. And I just, I just don't like any of that. Maybe quick slants. We'll give that a go. This is not the correct profile, guys. That's tough. How is that not pass interference? Okay, we're looking a little rough on offense and defense. Just all at the same time. Yeah, okay, we're going to punt that away. My goodness. We'll figure the offense out at some point this season, maybe. But first, let's figure out the defense and see if we can stop them on third and fourth down. Get him. Good tackle. Okay, three receivers. And we'll go nickel. All right. <coughs> Ooh. Bless me. My goodness. That came out of nowhere. Let's go defense. Oh, my goodness. Thank, thank you, Jesus, <laughs> for him not catching that. All right, this is a big play. I'm going to go dime. Full zone. Haven't stopped him on third down. Well, we stopped him on third down once, and then they got the fourth down immediately. So, let's go. All right. Quick three and out. Get the offense back out there. We're going to try some, try some runs, maybe. Thank you, Ashley. That sneeze really snuck up on me. Why is Tyler returning punts when I did not put him on punts? Okay. Unless somebody got hurt. Try to get our speedy running back, Dalton in the open field here. I'll get him a few yards. Oh my goodness, we almost broke free on the outside. He's trying to help any way he can. Yeah, on the punt return. Yeah, I, I'm pretty sure I put somebody else there. I don't know how he ended up back on there, but... Oh well. He's just out there trying to make plays. Let me get this off the fullback. On third and one. Easy. 
Okay, Garrett. Biggest play of the day so far for the offense. We're figuring it out. Try to blast to the other side. Five more yards right up the middle. So tackle. Just trying to relearn the entire offense. This could be a good run. There you go, Dalton. The speedster. NCAA Baseball, I do own that, Tyler. Listen, man, now that I can stream, you know, I, I can play anything I want. I'm going to be bringing back the Arena Football League series as well. See if we can't get James Hickenbotham back in the live stream. Because that was really cool to see one of our players on our team actually tune in. Man, Robbie Ballard only gets a yard or two up the middle. But don't worry, guys. We're going to be bringing back some some really good series that we had on the channel over the over the years. All right, we're down seven nothing as we go into the second. I don't really know what to do as far as throwing the football at the moment. Let's do some quick curls. Bring back the EFL. Uh, that's I don't know about the EFL at the moment. It's a lot of work doing a full league. Nobody's getting open. Yeah, passing is not working right now. The receivers are getting no separation, and my O-line is getting demolished. Can't remember what plays work and what route combinations work right now. Chuck it up. And can't get there. Dang it, another fourth down coming up. Crowd not really happy at the moment. That was a successful drive, though. You know, we got got down the field some. I'm going to try to go for it anyway. We got Hawkins one-on-one -on -one left side. Roy's open, and he hangs on. Let's go. Beautiful. And we're going to go no huddle here. I like the mismatch. Try to clear the middle. In the end zone. Oh, can't get there. Dang it. All right, let's go back to the ground. I'm not going to do a toss play again. The toss didn't work. I think it's, it might just be the animation for toss plays. It just takes a little bit too long to, to develop. Let's go. Big fullback time. Eight or nine yards up the gut. He's had a pretty good career. I, don't wanna, I think our best player on the team is the other fullback. But, you know, Garrett's a senior, I, and the other guy's a junior. We're going to get him for, for two seasons at fullback, and he's really good. Uh, after this season, so had to do it. I don't know if Garrett got that. He did. All right, we're in business. Wide open. Touchdown, Mississippi State. Let's go, baby. We're figuring it out. We're getting there. See how my kicking is. That was pretty good. And they walked right through the middle. My goodness. Pass 
pass in game stops you from playing 04. Man, it, did you watch the, the Tar Heels dynasty that I have on the channel? The passing attack we have in that series is so electric, man. You can throw the ball really well in that game. You just got to find the right playbook and the right players for the playbook. Ah, man. Tate, their fullback's having a pretty good game so far. A big run, now a nice catch to the right side. Picking up 10. Yeah, what works really well in 04 is short and intermediate routes. And some of those combos, if you have trips on like the left or the right side, and you have the right route combination, you know, you can get a deep pass while the two other guys are, you know, going short and intermediate. You can have a streak down, down the right sideline or something that can be wide open. It's all about timing a pump fake, too. There's some really good pump fakes in that series. Third down and two. And they got it. Man, this fullback is good. I just can't seem to stop him. Fleet Woodard, they're testing the true freshman strong safety, and he did all right for himself on that one. Second down and ten for Southern Miss. Low scoring affair so far. George Tyler misses a tackle, and Tate just carries another guy. My goodness. Is this guy a fullback? He's got to be, right? Salazar. All right, third and one. Haven't stopped him yet. Short situation like this, so. Blitz and right. Ah, I'm... I guess right. I just couldn't bring him down. Dang it. Down. Oh, he cuts it back to the left. Perkins getting crazy. Taken off, and I missed. Dang it. A lot of open field misses so far for some of our defenders, including myself. And thank goodness that was a bad pass because I left my zone. That should have been an easy touchdown for them. first half. No, oh my goodness. Great deflection by the linebacker. I didn't even see which one it was. Beautiful play. Are going to show a replay? Of course they're not. Why would they? Give my boy some credit. Oof. Who was that? Salazar. Let's go, buddy. 
Love it. And they're going to go for it. Oh, my. Fourth and 14. I guess it makes sense. They're not really in a great spot for a field goal. And a little too close to punt. I'd like for the D-line to actually do something here. Get some pressure on him. Let's go. Big time stop. Alright, now it's our turn. Yeah, Hail Mary. You're right. Let's go play action. See if we can't set up a streak on the right sideline with Davis. Or fuck a sack for a big loss. Open. Oh, you just missed him. Oh my goodness. Dang. Just 4 of 8, 50 yards and a touchdown for Watson so far in the day. Pitch it. And Dalton goes nowhere on the option. This defense is kind of nasty. Alright, let's go 5 wide. Let's go posts. Open. And Roy hangs on. Let's go. Alright, so the post is working. They got a little bit of a weakness at safety. Hawkins. Can't get there. Dang it. Alright, settle down now. Run the ball. Of course, as soon as we pick a run play, they're stacking the box. And Dalton, actually a pretty good game there. Let's go no huddle. Oh, big run. Oh, he gets tripped up. Man, still got the first down though. We'll take that. I'm gonna go dive again. Might be alright here against 3 4. Here we go. Beautiful run for Dalton inside the 15 yard line. We're cooking. And Dalton is tired now, so we got Robbie Ballard back there. Oh, nice to... No way! Oh, my goodness gracious. What a play by the defensive tackle. you got to be kidding me, man. That is outrageous. Dang it. Tyler, good tackle. Yeah, that pick was definitely tough, man. Just a really good play, you know? The ball physics in this game in 04 are fantastic. Oh my goodness, we got a sack? That's been a uh, recurring issue for us in this series the last five seasons. Not getting a lot of pressure on quarterbacks. Get him. Let's go. All right, we have no timeouts left now. Why is George Tyler returning my punts? Lock there or make a man miss. All right, let's try this again uh, without the interception from a defensive tackle, please. All right, we got 
single coverage here on the right. And on the left, he's wide open. Let's go. Touchdown, Mississippi State, baby. Woo, that was pretty. What a throw from Watson. Hey, he's got a cannon. And Hawkins is just wide open all by himself on the left. Take a look here. See what happened in the secondary. That's all it takes. Look at that pump fake. It freezes the corner. And the safety just stops moving as well to free up Hawkins for the easy touchdown. That's all it takes sometimes. A well-timed pump fake. And we've got the lead. to seven, just 39 seconds left. No, sir, you are not dreaming. The Mississippi State Bulldogs are back. Yes, indeed. Season six and beyond. Had to bring back the classic, man, for our Return to PS2 streaming. Oh my goodness, he should have had the pick right there. I don't even know if he ever saw the ball. Yeah, we, we left a lot on the table here for this series. You know, only one bowl win, one conference title, one national championship. You know, it's unfinished business. We, we, gotta, we gotta get some more bowl wins here for the dogs. Oh my goodness, this guy's a monster. Stop him, please. Hail State, yes sir. Let's go. Right. Single coverage here on the tight end. They're going to try and get something going here. And they're not going to have it. The user interception, George Tyler. Let's go, baby. My fingertipless self with the pick. All right, we got time here. We have no timeouts left, though. Crowd is going bananas. Bananas. All right, I'm looking on the outsides here. Got him wide open. And that's unfortunate. No huddle. Please. Please. Think you're still one of the running backs? Is that you, Robbie? Oh, I missed. I had circle wide open. I don't think I can make that field goal. We're gonna go Hail Mary. Come on, Davis. He got it. Touchdown off the Hail Mary. Let's go. That is you, Robbie. What's up, brother? Yes, you still are a running back on the roster. Absolutely, sir. I don't know if you got a carry. Yeah, you got one carry so far in this ball game for like a yard. You're tied with Dalton for... Highest overall in the running back room at the moment. I think you're both 79 overall. You're just a little bit slow to be the starter. But we are cooking right now. Let's go. Let's go. Third quarter, about to start. All right, we got our passing attack going. We got the running game working a little bit as well. M -m -m my Moreno. Okay, everybody on the left side fell down. Tulsa did not show up for that game against Tennessee. I'm going to try draw play. Probably going to regret it instantly. Oh 
my. Oh, Dalton. Whew. Man, he's shifty. Looking like a, a young Warwick Dunn out here, you know? Alright, should we try... Let's try a screen pass. Just living a thing called life. Love to hear it, man. Wide open. Might have been able to juke that to the left side to get to the outside, but we'll take the first down. Let's see what my boy Robbie can do. Look at Watson. Three touchdowns today. Impressive. Yeah, not a whole lot of blocking on that one. Nice corner blitz. Really well timed for Southern Miss. That's right, Robbie. We'll, we'll get you some, some touches throughout the year for sure. As I give it to the fullback, they put their safeties on the line of scrimmage. Now they're going to force us to throw it, which is kind of weird because it's been pretty successful throwing it. Let's go wide receiver post, right side. Catch. Oh, just didn't get the first down. Yeah, we'll punt this one away. How's the family doing? Doing all right, man. Not too bad. Not bad at all. Not standing. That was a good punt. Let the defense get back to work. So yeah, just went and watched two of my kids did a Christmas concert on Wednesday. That was really fun. My kids are a bunch of characters, so they stand out during concerts. Other than that, I've just been working. That's all I do. Work and uh, more work, you know. I really like this counter. Good tackle, Tyler. Let's go. I guess having a pretty good game. I guess he is the halfback. I thought he was a fullback. I, he definitely lined up at fullback on the goal line play on uh, fourth and inches where he ran for 20 yards on us. Third down and three. Play action. And forced him to throw it out. Let's go. Defense standing tall today. Family times are the best times. Yes, sir. Got that right. Yeah, we're going to let that bounce. I ain't touching that. No, sir. play action going here. This could be alright. Maybe. He's got him beat. Uh-oh, I got crushed. And Davis comes down with it anyway inside the 20-yard line. Oh, my word. Getting Watson over 200 yards passing on the day to go along with those three touchdowns. Man, that was pretty... Defense looks great. Yeah, we started off a little rocky, but I think they're uh, they're finding it, man. They're doing it. Wow, nice block by the fullback. Just letting the linebacker walk through untouched. That was great. Yeah, our defense is really young, though. We get a senior at free safety, George Tyler. I think one of the corners is a junior or a senior. Senior at D tackle, and the rest are freshman and sophomore. Oh, wide open. Easy money. Touchdown, Mississippi State. We are cruising, boys. What a route that was as well. Four touchdowns now for Watson. 
And we have found the offense. That's what I was really worried about, figuring out the offense. I know in Season 5, we really struggled on the offensive side. You know, nobody could block. Watson was getting sacked a lot when he was a starter. We ended up switching to Terry, and he led us throughout the rest of the season. But right now, it doesn't look like we, we might not need a scrambling quarterback at the moment, which is a little bit different for us in this series, going from Ken Tops to Terry. Y'all remember the, the legend of Ken Tops? If you haven't seen his Heisman highlight video, you gotta go check that one out. It's in the playlist. Bulldogs, baby. Alright. See if the defense can keep holding strong. Do a toss here, that running back. Oh my. And Tyler brings him down at the 26 yard line. Right, 28 to 7 here in the third quarter. I think I'm going to blitz with Tyler on this one. For show. Didn't work out too well. Southern Miss has pretty much abandoned the pass, which is kind of strange. They started the game two for two with like 49 yards passing, and they have 19 yards passing since that first drive. Not sure why they gave up on it so quickly when it was working. And, well, maybe that's the reason. Their quarterback looking a little inaccurate. Let's go nickel. Combo. And this is a big time win for us, too, if we can hang on. I mean, Southern Miss is ranked 31st in the country. As I completely whip on that tackle attempt with Tyler. And they just had one hell of a recruiting class. A bunch of five stars and four star recruits committed to Southern Miss. Go back to nickel, double slot. And overthrown again. Receiver looking for pass interference. I'm not sure what he's smoking, but I'll take some of that. I'm blitzing. I missed. But hey, the thought was there, you know? I really tried. <laughs> Gave it my all. Let's go quarterback contain. I just don't want him to end up scrambling for a first down. Uh oh, covering two guys. We get another sack, our second on the day. Let's go. Man. Really nice to have multiple sacks in one game mentioned before, you know, that's that's been a struggle for, for this team in the first five seasons. Getting the quarterback just haven't really been that successful at it. Come on, get some blocking, please. No? Alright, cool. I still don't know why Tyler's returning punts. That's okay. Try a receiver screen here on the right side with Roy. We get the blocking set up. It might be okay. This is probably going to be terrible, to be honest. 
couldn't get through the blocking. Watch, remember the Titans enough to know that if you blitz all night, they won't gain another yard. That is very true. Truer words have never been spoken. All right, get your fours up in the chat. We're on top 28 to 7 over Southern Miss here in Starkville, Mississippi. A good run for Ballard right up that gut almost getting the first down third and inches coming up Let's get it off a fullback now and Garrett oh my goodness just runs a man smooth over gets the first down easily we're getting close to a hundred yards rushing for the ball game get some extra blocking on that left side. And that did not work out as well as I thought it would. Just trying not to do anything too crazy here. Don't want anybody to get injured. Try to get the dub. And Ballard just doesn't have the speed to, to get out to the outside there. That's all right. Let's go corner route on the right. And nice catch for Davis. And almost gets free for the touchdown. Oh my goodness. Davis over the century mark now. Four catches, a buck 05. Roy and Hawkins both with 63 yards receiving today. Making some plays. has the speed to get to the outside, that's for sure. Easy first down. He's up to 67 yards on the ground. yards for Ballard. He'll definitely get you at least one or two yards every time he touches the ball. I'm going to try a screen, get Dalton out in the open field. Just trying to run the clock down, honestly. And that was not a good throw. Would have been nice if the running back tried to come towards the ball, but he's just not about that life, I guess. All right, so two interceptions now in the day for Watson, unfortunately. Sorry, right, still up by three touchdowns, though. George Tyler just got stiff-armed all the way to Narnia with that one. Defensive end. All right, 
we're not going to go goal line defense this time. We're going to go man lock on 5-2. Get him! And we did, but I think he spun far enough forward to get that first down. And not a good throw from the quarterback. Just 6 of 19. Man, he had 49 yards on his first two completions. And hasn't done much since. Not really too sure what happened. Just the one interception from him. Quick five yard reception. They're going to go no huddle now. And nice deflection by the corner. Is that Moreno? Obviously, they're going to go for it here. And that was Moreno. We got Grimes on the right side. Come on, get some pressure on this QB, please. And that is incomplete. Let's go. Good stop by the defense after we threw our second pick of the game. And we are just going to run the ball now. Also, the first time we've ever streamed the Bulldogs. The entire series up until now was all edited videos. 75 of them to be exact. Which was not fun. Editing videos is, is just like the least fun thing for me of all time. Alright Robbie, let's get this first down buddy. I think so. First down. Good run. And we're up to 40 views so far. 41 views now on the stream. Don't forget to slap the like button if you haven't already. And consider subscribing if you are also not subscribed. We are back to PS2 football on the channel. Might get crazy and actually throw this here. We got him beat. Hawkins touchdown, Mississippi State. Five touchdown passes on the day for Watson. Just a beautiful throw. Wow, that was a late hit on the quarterback as well. Stood in the pocket. Delivered a strike. And we are over 400 yards of offense with that. point from the freshman kicker Hayes is up and it is good. Do, 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 do. All right, just a minute 
And eight seconds left in the ball game. Play action. And not a good throw. This quarterback is in shambles right now. In absolute shambles, I say. back inside. We'll let him get a few yards. Sorry about the Panthers. It's okay, Tyler. I'm sorry about Michigan's inevitable loss to Alabama coming up. looking play there and they're gonna punt it away after calling a timeout and we'll run it a couple times get on out of here with the dub first one of the season gets two or three. Got 19 yards today. I mean, he will get you at least two yards per carry. That, I mean, that's a guarantee. And a fullback up the middle. That will do it. Let me turn the uh, sound back on. This is what I always used to do for for the games after I edited them and all that fun, happy stuff. Third and five, ball on the 44. Hear the post-game talk from the fellas up in the booth. The Golden Eagles bring in their dive package. And this blowout is finally over. Any final thoughts on this one, Coach? This was an impressive victory. Mississippi State played what up, Audrey? a game out there, dominating on both sides of the ball. You better slap that like button. Pretty good after blowing out a team like this. Well, that'll wrap up another chapter in NCAA Football 2003. And again, our final score, Mississippi State 35, Southern Miss 7. This is Brad Nessler for Lee Corso and Kirk Herbstreit saying so long. All right, so head coach. Ralph Kress adds another victory. That is number 51 for his career. Not including the bowl game, I'm pretty sure. Over 400 yards of offense here today. And Southern Miss had 49 yards passing on their first two passes of the game and only got 20 for the rest of the day. I don't know what happened. Watson, 15 of 23, 289 yards, five touchdowns. I think we found a quarterback here. Jamar Dalton, 72 yards. Garrett, 38. Ballard with 19. Watson sacked a couple times there. Two receivers over 100 yards. Both had two touchdowns. Webb had a touchdown. Not a bad day. Dan Meal, Contreras had sacks today. George Tyler with a pick for the senior. Some deflections. And that is going to do it for this game. Let's see who we're going to be playing next. I think it's, who is it, Indiana? Out the schedule. That's okay. Yeah, we 
go ahead and save everything. As we do with uh, PS2 games, in fear of something catastrophic happening and losing all of our progress. Not a bad start to season six. 35 to seven victory for us. Not bad at all. And the stream still going extremely strong right now. Zero drop frames. And currently using 4.6% of my computer. We're looking good. Traveling to Bloomington, Indiana, take on the Hoosiers, who are 1 and 0, ranked 99th in the country. They put up 42 points in their last game. Threw the ball for 316 yards. All right, so definitely gonna have to keep an eye on that passing attack. They can run the ball a little bit too. 167 yards. Let's see who they play. Indiana. All right, so they beat Kentucky, 42 to 33. So they got a win already against an SEC program, but Indiana, just a one-star team, prestige. That's a little bit rough. And we are five stars, of course. All right, next two games, I'm, I'm not going to overlook Indiana. You know, that, that could be a tough game. Uh, UL Monroe, they're ranked right around the same spot as Indiana. And after that, we're going to get into SEC play. Now, like I said, I don't know how many games we're going to play here today, but I'm just going to keep going. Because why not? I haven't streamed football in forever, so. I turned uh, coach contracts off. So we don't need to see all that, which is fine. 51 victories so far here in year six. This is not a televised game. As we travel to Bloomington, we did not move in the rankings whatsoever. Still at 24. Got to prove ourselves. All right, what are these guys wearing? All right, we're gonna go all white for this one. Cause why not? Let's get it. Just what a beautiful, beautiful graphic I made. You know. Glorious. Crowd's real hype for this one. This is going to be a quiet afternoon, I think. Oh, there we go. They're making some noise now. Okay. That was a nice kick. Oh my goodness. Alright, they're going to come out full back and a half back. I don't know what kind of offense these guys run. Right now. 
they're just going to try to run the football on us all game, which is kind of weird. You know, their offense had over 300 yards passing. Third down and four coming up. And Tyler almost gets the pick. Home to a punt already. I'll take it. Not touching that. Nope. Oh, what is this offense? Uh oh. Our playbook got switched. Oh no. Oh no, boys. That's alright, we're gonna have to try to rock with it. I'm not quitting. Yeah, we'll take the delay. It's fine. How the heck did the playbook get switched? Okay, Brown. All right, this guy's annoying. I don't know how the heck the uh, playbook got switched. And Dalton will pick up the first down. Pretty easy. Man, this playbook is crazy. Don't tell me this is what Mississippi State used to run. That'd be insane. Orlando! Mr. Webb getting first down. Is this the playbook that I had when we had Ken Tops? There's no way, right? Oh, wide open. Oh, Dalton drops it. Come on, man. That's unfortunate. three or four yards. Ah, oh, dang it. I definitely misplayed that. That's unfortunate. field goal, not with his kicker. And instantly sacked. That's tough. like this playbook that we have. Just got to try to make it work. Oh, nice to 
deflection for Moreno. And third down and six coming up. Let's go. Let's go three four. I don't really like running three four too much. Oh, nice catch by Riddle. Come on, man. Dang it. Another sack. Okay. Defense is getting after the quarterback now. It's our third sack already. This is uh, the second game, which is kind of crazy. I will take it. You can pretty much hear a pin drop in this stadium. Oh my goodness, what a catch! No way. Double coverage. Matthews comes down with it. That was a little bit of life in the stands. Man. Not liking that our strong safety Woodard, true freshman, is missing so many tackles. He's wide open, but he's not fast enough. All right, goal line. Let's go 5-2, man lock. Press the coverage. Get the stop. Oh, my goodness. Indiana strikes first. Did not see that coming. Let's try to figure out this playbook. I don't know what the heck's going on, but it's a really, really different playbook from the one that we just used. figure it out. Yo, what up, Jared? What's going on, brother? Just enjoying some Mississippi State Bulldog Dynasty, my friend. And I can't escape the pocket there. I'm trying to run a little bit here <laughs> with a statue. Man, this playbook is just throwing me for a loop right now. How did our playbook get changed? I need to know. Come on, Davis. Oh my goodness, just overthrew him. This playbook is killing me. Brown drops it. Wow. We got to figure out this offense and figure it out quick. Another three and out. Let's 
Please tackle him. Hello? My goodness. Still got three quarters to get back on track. Yeah, that's true. Just trying to learn a new playbook. It's switched for whatever reason. That was a nice play. This is it's a completely different playbook than than the one we just had. This one's got a bunch of option stuff in it. I don't know what the heck happened. down and 20 situation. No way. He just got that first down third and 20. Good lord. I don't know where Woodard was. Strong safety should have been over there. Got that one. Let's go, Woodard. First career interception for the true freshman strong safety. Look at them all swagged out. I didn't even put any of that stuff on them. All right. So, offense. Shall we? Shall we figure it out, please? Let's go sweep I just don't know anything that works in this playbook. Here we go. Let's go, Dalton. Get the outside. I'll take that. Sweep going again. Nope. My goodness. Well, that's going to be the end of the first quarter. We're down seven nothing to the Hoosiers of Indiana. I don't know what's happening. <laughs> All right, I'm going to send Hawkins deep. You got him beat. Come on, Hawkins. You got it inside the 10-yard line. We're cooking. Let's go. Let's go, baby. That quieted the crowd down instantly. My goodness. Yeah, these plays don't work with the speed that we have. Man. Lots and slow. Yeah, he's his speed's like 56. Oh, and a false start on the left guard there. Try a wide receiver screen. One-on-one -on -one over there. And Dalton couldn't block him. Man. Third and goal. 
from the 19. The wide receiver under. He's got that like slant corner route to Webb might work. Oh, he's open. Not going to get the touchdown, but we can kick a field goal here. Alabama getting crushed in Tuscaloosa. My goodness. Going to see the first career field goal attempt for Mr. Hayes, the true freshman. Kick is up, and the kick is good. It's 7-3 to three now. That was a pretty good drive. Ain't no way he's going to return that. Oh my goodness, he did. Tackle by Tyler. That was a good route from Matthews. Alright, third down and short now. Gotta get the stop. I want to get the offense back out there. Missed the tackle, then he breaks two tackles to get the first. That's crazy. Figure it out, defense. Come on. There we go. Okay, third and we bought uh, like six yards, I think, maybe, possibly. Yes, okay. I'm going to stick with the 4 3. Stop for the defense. All right, we got some time. Three and a half minutes. Get something else going here. They're going to play. Oh. Press coverage on the right. And no blocking from the right tackle, so there's there's that. What's going on, brother? What's happening? We don't need to see that play again. That was that was rough. The wide receiver post. That frees up Davis on the right side. Single coverage. Might see Webb on the left. Come on, Davis. He's wide open. Oh, nice deflection. Oh, my goodness gracious. Third and 14. Keep attack over the middle. For chance. A couple of hot routes there. No! Somebody help me, please! Dang it. Yeah, this offense is tough. Pre 
appreciate it, man. Come on, Kramer, get down there. Uh-oh. I missed. No, this is not good. Goodness gracious. Three four defense. We need a big play on defense because the offense is just stalling out. Just don't know what to do with this playbook. It's terrible. Appreciate it, Jared. Feels damn good to be back, man. Blocked by the ref. Typical. 03. Alright, let's see. I'm gonna blitz a couple linebackers here. Let's go fire man. Man coverage. Across the board. Can we switch that? Thank you. My goodness. Counter. Get him. Oh my goodness. There we go. Force them back inside. Got the stop. And they're gonna go for it. Of course they are. Why not? Let's get them. Fourth and two. They're going to go dive. Might go outside here. Pass. Where are you going? Where are you going? Nowhere. Get that weak sauce out of here, bro. Come on now. All right. We're chucking it because I don't know what to do on offense. <laughs> Web, get there. And he drops it. Of course he does. Alright, maybe maybe not five wide. Alright, we can try to run it here on this formation. Not a huge fan of it. Oh my goodness. Playbook is atrocious. To win this game, we're going to need like one or two big plays. Yeah, there's no way this works. Hawkins, you want to come back for it? No? You want to just stand there 50 yards downfield? Man. What was he doing? Get that. We're inside the five. Kramer, please. Let's go. What a punt that was. Beautiful. I'm going to blitz a corner here. I got deep middle with Tyler. He got crushed. Come on, linebackers, please. What do you run the clock out for? You're not actually running it out. And Tyler almost gets the pick there. My goodness. And we hit the quarterback, I think. Yep. Okay. Don't want to give up a big play here. I'm just going to blitz one linebacker. I'm blitzing. Oh, come on. No way. No way. Damn, that is really unfortunate. 
Oh, third and eight, and we give up a big run. Well, they're going to have the lead going into the half unless they turn the ball over here and get something going. But Man, he's injured. I'm going to call a timeout. Not that it's going to matter too much. John Perez, my brother. What's going on, man? Great to see you, man. Man, that's our last time out. I doubt they're going to throw it here. No way. Pull back. All right, I was hoping for possible takeaway there, but that is going to do it for the first half. We're down 7-3. to three. The game inexplicably switched our playbook to the hot garbage that you're seeing right now on offense from us. Uh, so yeah, we gotta just find a way to work through it, I guess. It's great to be streaming, man. It really is. It's been far too long. I literally can't use, let's see, one, two, three, four. I can't use running backs on four of my formations. This quarterback is not fast enough. Oh my goodness, I saw the opening of the Red Sea right there. I mean, my goodness. We nearly just broke that right up the middle. That would have been insane. Were this Willers away? Absolutely. We're going to figure it out. We're going to win this game ugly. But we're doing it. No! Oh my god! Dalton, no! Uh, okay, we're going to win real ugly. Let me rephrase that. How do you fumble that? You don't even get tackled. That hit Vung's left butt cheek. Come on, bruh. We got a butt fumble on the channel? I mean, not as severe as Mark Sanchez, but in the same realm. Oh, my Grimes, how do you get beat like that? Gotta hold him to a field goal here. Gotta have it. That was a good tackle. Alright, third down. Come on, boys. Get him. We cannot stop third and fourth and short. We just can't do it. I don't know what the crowd is chanting right now. I can't understand any of it. They are just content with running the ball just down our throats this game. And I don't blame them. We can't do anything else. We're lucky we got a field goal. I'm just going to have to start throwing the ball deep downfield. See if our, our tall receivers can win some one-on-ones, I think. Man, that is overthrown in the back of the end zone. Can we please stop them? He broke my tackle and nearly got the first down. Oh my goodness. Alright, we held him to a field goal at least. Yeah, 
we're definitely going to have to throw it deep. Throw medium and deep passes. Wow, he almost hooked that at the last second. That would have been bonkers. Dalton out of here. Make up for that fumble. There we go, Davis. I like that. Let's go, Watson. He had five touchdown passes last game, and this time you can barely hit water if you fell out of a boat. Take the yards anywhere we can get them right now. And Webb wide open, first down. DB tried to get the pick, but whiffed on it badly. Okay, Brown. That's what I'm talking about, baby. Let's go. We got mismatches here. I'm going no huddle. We're going to send Brown on an in right there. Somebody get open, please. Oh, my goodness. Hawkins just mossed him. Let's go. Oh, that was beautiful. What a throw and catch. And we don't even get a replay of that. Come on, man. Do my guys dirty like that. Look at look at Watson rolling out for like a day and a half. So slow. What a throw. Right over his head. Look at that. Get wrecked, son. What a play that was. Time to tie it up with the extra point. Kick is up, and kick is good. Ten all here in the third. Watson's going to earn that massage. Oh, my God. <laughs> Come on, man. <laughs> That's tough. Counter. Hey, we're up to 55 views on the stream so far today. Not bad, not bad at all. Don't forget to slap the like button if you haven't already, guys. Caress it, you know. Just a little light tap, if you will. Whatever you prefer. Alright, they're down to nine. This is a big play for us. No way. Oh my goodness. We have no defense on third down. It doesn't matter how many yards they need. They've converted on third and 20 in this game. Crazy. We are in a dogfight, boys. My X 
accidentally hit X. You set a circle for speed. Fresno State still crushing teams, man. I don't know how they got so good. Zion needs to hold off on the eating. You know what I'm saying? It's like he's doing too much. If he just can work out, I, dude, he could be one of the greatest of all time. If he could just get it together, man. screen for the Hoosiers. So cover three strong. I got deep middle with Tyler. Second down, 13 to go after the loss on the wide receiver screen. They're going to go option and that was a good decision because we can't stop anything. Okay, okay, farmer. I see you. Zion doesn't care about basketball. I mean, that's what it seems like. Like, man. If I had that ability, you best believe I would just be killing it. Oh, come on. I'd be doing windmill dunks and just every time I had the ball, you know? Kind of like the Hoosiers right now, just dunking on us because we can't stop them. Can't tackle anybody. And he dove and missed the end zone, so we'll take it. <laughs> Get your fours up in the chat. We're all tied up. Ten apiece here in Bloomington, Indiana. Definitely did not see this happening today. And that was easy money for Indiana, my goodness. They are just having their way with us when they're on offense. Can't stop them. All right, 17 to 10. That was a great drive. 11 plays, 67 yards. 316 off the clock. kick this one out of bounds, so we're going to have good field position to start this next drive. Alright. We're going to have to rely on Watson. Oh, he beat him. The pump fake got him. Hawkins down to the 15-yard line. What a play. Yeah, this pump fake right here throws the corner for a split second. Yeah, watch this pump fake. Watch the corner. Boom. Bit on it. Just for a split second. That's what a good pump fake can do for you. Get you all the way down the field in an instant. Alright, 
Robbie Ballard up the middle, a couple yards. We cannot run the ball with this playbook. That's for dang sure. Not for a lack of trying, though. I'm trying to give these boys some opportunities. There we go, Dalton. You didn't fumble that time, buddy. All right. At the one-yard line. Play action was so much better in these old games. Absolutely. I agree 100%. And Ballard stuffed in the backfield. Can't get in there. This is where this playbook is going to be really tough for us to get anything happening. Yeah, play action, pump fakes, they're absolute killers in these older games. Come on, Garrett, touchdown, MSU, let's go. The big fullback rumbles on in for the score. His first of the season. Our first rushing touchdown of the year as well. Up until that point, we had six touchdown passes. going to be a really good ending to this ball game. Five and a half minutes remaining. Freshman kicker ties it up at 17 apiece. Copeland does have a kick return touchdown in his career. So look out. Defense. Let's let's try to figure something out here. So whatever we're doing just ain't working. Gotta get some pressure from the D line. That has definitely been a big problem. And not tackling. My goodness. understand why we have so many missed tackles. Like, I know we got some young guys out there, but even even the upperclassmen are missing a lot of tackles. Dang. Moreno getting beat on the left side. Man-to-man -man coverage. situation like this, I want to blitz, but <laughs> I'm not doing it. And Pena gets a few yards on the reception. Marvin Joseph, what's going on, brother? Hope you are doing well, my friend. Form tackling drills in practice next week? Absolutely. Got to figure that out, or we're going to be in trouble this season. Especially when we get into SEC play. Tyler, five tackles, one for a loss today. And third down, seven coming up. Come on, boys. Nice deflection, almost picked off. Oh, my. All right, we got a much-needed stop there. Got a chance to go down the field and take the lead, which would be amazing. Oh, I'm going to lose the block. Come on. All right. All we need is a field goal. Of course, we're going to go for a touchdown, though. That's just what we do. Yeah, Marvin, totally understand that, buddy. Gotta get your sleep, my friend. 
pullback option. Okay, Garrett. I see you. You better get up off that ground, though. Pull back out here juking people. That's crazy. I don't think this play is going to work, but we're going to give it a go. We're going to give it our best shot. Nope. Dalton. Woo! That bounce was crazy. All right, so no more of that. <laughs> Jeez. That could have been catastrophic. It's all right. Dalton made up for... That last um, fumble that he had earlier in the game. He's wide open. There you go, Hawkins. Okay. Down to the 44-yard line of Indiana. He's having a great day. Four catches, 133 yards. Haven't seen much of Davis on the right side, though. Hawkins over 200 yards receiving for the season. Dalton. Oh, he can't hang on. That was a tough catch. Try to make for that halfback. Sorry, I'm not going to fault him for that. There was a lot of traffic around him when he was trying to catch it. Only gets a yard, maybe. They're down to nine coming up. This is going to be a tricky play here. All right, they're moving the safety up. Our backup quarterback is in. That was Cletus Pace who throws a touchdown on his first career pass attempt. I don't know what happened to Watson, but Pace came in and said, let me ball, coach. And we're going to take the lead just like that. Wow. Drop that pass in a bucket. Good old Cletus Pace, one for one with a touchdown in his career. That is crazy. What happened to my quarterback, though? <laughs> Where did Watson go? Six plays, 80 yards, 141 off the clock, and it's 24-17 Bulldogs on top here in Bloomington, Indiana. Had I known <laughs> that the backup quarterback was in, I don't know if I would have selected that play. So I'm glad I didn't notice until after the throw. Like, wait a minute. Who is this small, skinny white kid? What is going on? Second like down at seven. They're going to go no huddle here. And Grimes has the interception. Let's go. His first of the season. Time to just put this one away now. I mean, he basically ran the route for him. And Pace is still in at quarterback. I do have to check to see what happened to my guy here. No injuries. Interesting. Very interesting. Okay, Pace. He's a baller. I guess he can run the option a little, huh? And Garrett, the big fullback. Going to move the chains. Hoosiers call their first time out of the half. And we do have... Watson back in there. And 
next, I don't remember who we have. And Garrett crushing the backfield. My goodness, they got in there pretty quick. I don't know how many games we're playing today, but I'm just going to keep on going. Not sure what really happened to Watson, but, you know, he's back in there. And, uh, goes nowhere. He cannot move at all. He is Drew Bledsoe reincarnated. Alright, we don't have to do anything crazy here. We're in field goal range. Let the time run out as much as we can. And Dalton goes down after a yard. They're going to call their last time out. And we're going to attempt a field goal here. It'll be a 35 yard attempt. Just the second attempt for the freshman kicker, Hayes. Not really a lot of wind. And Hayes' kick is up, and we got it. We're up by 10 points now. And, yeah, 36 yarder, longest ever, apparently. I don't know, I have something... Something happened before this game with the profile. Switch our playbook and everything. But anyways, we're up by 10. We're doing good. That was a real rocky start to the ball game, though. Hoosiers with no timeouts remaining, down by two scores. Got to expect some, some throws down the field here. Pressure on the quarterback, and Woodard gets the pick. Another user interception. Woodard's second pick of the ball game. Not a bad day for the true freshman. And the Bulldogs are going to look to close it out here with a couple runs. I think we have UL Monroe next. I could be wrong. And Garrett just going to lose a couple yards. Hey, give it up to the Indiana band, though. Still going strong, supporting their team, even though they're going to lose. Let this run down all the way to one second. Call a timeout. That play is not going to work. Should be able to just kneel it here. What is that dude? Yeah, he needs to learn how to tackle a little bit better. But other than that, he's doing pretty good today. And he gets player of the game. Six tackles, two interceptions. He definitely got run over several times, though. So, tackling drills, all we can practice. But we do close this one out. 27-17 to 17 is going to be the final, as we just really couldn't get the, the run game going. Uh, but again, the, the playbook being switched somehow before the game really just threw me for a loop <laughs> for the whole first half, I think. But we found a way to win it ugly. Take a look at the stats. Yeah, there wasn't a whole lot going on. We got sacked three times. We sacked them once. We were not very good on third downs. We had one fumble loss. No picks today. It's the box score. 7-3 at halftime. And they were actually up. 10 to 3. A couple lead changes there. Yeah, pace. 1 for 1, 43 yards, touchdown. What what a QBR. 791.2. What's up? <laughs> Kalidus. What a legend. Yeah, rushing. Man, rushing was really rough. 
receiving. Hawkins had a great game. Uh, Davis did have the touchdown from Pace right at the end there. And he drops. One drop. Orlando Webb. Woodard and Salazar, six tackles each. Tyler and Singleton each with five. We had five tackles for a loss today. One sack. Three picks. Sophomore gets his first pick of the season. Several deflections here. And four stumble from Ryan Atkins, the defensive tackle. Rick Hayes, true freshman kicker, two of two today. All right, and that is it for this game. When is the win even if it's ugly? Absolutely. Custom playbooks? Oh, man. That would have been amazing. Would have been just beautiful. Oh, you guys came to the stream late, but let me know what you guys think about this right here. What do you think about that bad boy? Nice little graphic. That's what I was working on before the stream. It was good times. I enjoy it. You know, since I never really do anything like technical wise, you know. Alright, we're gonna figure out what the heck happened to our playbook so we can actually have our playbook for this next game. Glad you guys like the graphic. Took me a while to figure it out, but I got it. All right. Let's see the through the week. And we actually went down in the rankings. We continued to fall down. We were 23rd in preseason polls. And then two weeks in a row we were 24th. And now we're 25th. Because, well, we haven't really beat anybody yet. I mean, Southern Miss was ranked 31st when we beat them. And they were 1-0. But uh, struggling with Indiana for what seemed like three quarters. And yeah, I guess I'll accept the, uh, the fall down to 25th. Michigan might have stole it. That's tough. Yeah, we're supposed to be running Texas Tech's offense. Got to fix that bowl record. One and four. That's tough. All right. Uh, let's see. Top 25 polls. Let's see who jumped us. So Tulane jumped us. And instead of putting them 25th, uh, they just decided to put them 24th for whatever reason. We're not getting much respect, even though we're in the SEC and we've won 52 games, uh, not counting the bowl game, I believe, over the last five-plus seasons. But I guess... All right, this is also not televised. But that's okay. I didn't expect this one to be televised. Playbook. Could be Texas Tech. All right, what are these guys wearing? All right, we're gonna make them look like Florida State, just because. Let me double check the playbook. Okay. Pretty sure it's supposed to be Texas Tech. Okay, we're doing it. Hopefully I didn't mess anything up. Alright, game number three on the season. Got some pretty... I mean, that game was pretty close against Indiana. You know, Southern Miss kind of fell apart. I don't know why they stopped throwing the football. They were 2 for 2, 49 yards, and then 
only completed, I think, four more passes all game for 20 more yards. So, uh, But running backs, teams have been able to run the ball all over us so far in the season. to 60 views on the stream. I was hoping to go on offense first so I could see if the playbook was correct. Oh, that was not a good kick. Okay, that was pretty good. I'll take it. See if we can stop this running back. Get that crowd volume up. Uh oh, Woodard gets the deflection. Nearly had his third pick in the last two games. I'm not sure what kind of offense these guys are going to try to run. A couple receivers, two tight ends. Interesting. Here we go, screen. Man, that went nowhere. After this game, I believe we go into conference play. I think we have LSU next. Should be a good matchup. Politically incorrect team names. Yes. Indeed. Oh, quarterback going to take off. Man, he does not get the first down. Really good stop on the first drive of the ball game. Let's see if our offense is correct this time. If not, it's going to be another weird one. Okay. All right, we have the right playbook, guys. We're okay. <laughs> we'll be able to run the football a little bit more successfully in this matchup. Bobby Ballard up the middle. Picks up about six. Got to think that we have a bit more speed than these guys. That's a nice run for Dalton. First down. We're going to try to win on the ground in this game. Goodness, 12 or 13 yards right up the middle. You know, we're facing, you know, a less skilled team. So I'd like to be able to exploit their weaknesses as much as possible. And if we could do that by running the ball down their throat all game, I'm all for it. I do like, I love running the football. I love it. Haven't been as successful doing it. Man, our receiver got clobbered over on the left side. I might have to throw it here now. got it, but we're going to go for it. Yes, we did. All right, we got the first down. Oh, here we go. Dalton's gone. Touchdown, MSU. Too easy. Once he gets to the outside, you're not going to catch him. What's his speed? 96, I think. Crazy.
Just eight passing yards on that first drive. I think I missed. Oh, maybe not. Wow, that did hook quite a bit at the end there. So the plays 61 yards, minute 48 off the clock. 53 rushing yards on the first drive. Very nice. And another nice kick. Stick with the 4 3 for now. Oh, I missed. It's alright. First, first down of the ball game for uh, Louisiana Monroe. I should have had that pick. Dang it. Holding. Yeah, we'll accept it. Why not? Really hoping for a user pick right there. I got one so far with Tyler. I got one with Woodard. I mean, it gave me credit for another one with Woodard, but I, I can't really accept that. Get him, please. Nice deflection. Get him. All right, 11 yard pickup for Johns. Green. No way. Oh my goodness. I thought he overthrew him by a mile. That was a great catch by Mendoza. Yeah, that was on me. I left my spot. Tight end having a pretty good season. Seven catches, 72 yards. Not bad. Tight end numbers, you know, are never very big in this game. the back of the intended target. Oh, he's wide open. Dang it. All right, Monroe, settle down. Making my young defense look bad out here. I might have switched a nickel. All these receivers that they keep having on the field. He's wide open. Oh, he overthrew him. My goodness. He could not have been more open. I'm blitzing. Uh, no, I'm not. I gotta cover the tight end. Mendoza. Get him. Let's go. Good tackle. for the D-line to get some pressure on the quarterback here. We do get 
the stop, though. Held him to a field goal. That was a really good drive for ULM. Webster, 2 of 3, along of 36 on the season. Pick it up, and good. 7 to 3. That was a great drive. 12 plays. My goodness. Why is Tyler on kick returns? I'll never understand it. I definitely did not put him there. And we're getting booed. Okay. One bad play. Fans are over it. <laughs> great. This drive is a bust. I like how the coach actually picked the play that I wanted anyway. I love the post route on this play. Wide open is Davis to the 40. Oh my goodness. Another pump fake. Got the corner to bite. today. So that's nice. Alright, let me get to the outside. Let's go, Dalton. Oh, why does he look tired? Big run anyway, inside the 30-yard line. Let's try to hit him with a corner route here with Webb. Nope, he's not open. Well, he is now. That was about a four-yard reception. We'll take it. That's fine. And the fullback misses block. All right. That's going to do it for the first quarter already. It's 7-3. to three. Mississippi State on top here at home. catch by Anderson but he's short of the sticks and we're gonna try a field goal here it's be a 38 yard field goal attempt for the freshman along of 36 on the season so far a little bit of wind coming towards us I missed it and the freshman pushes it to the right Tennessee barely beat Duke. That's outrageous. I'd be furious if I was a volunteer fan. My goodness. Oh, come on. How does he get through there? Third inch is coming up. They're in goal line set. Oh, 
know, maybe this Woodard over here on the right. And a good run for Murray gets the first down for UL Monroe. run again my goodness having a really hard time this season getting off of blockers play action and that's caught but I'm pretty sure it was out of bounds that's gonna be incomplete they're down three coming up and we're gonna blitz two linebackers on this play because why not? Get him! Let's go. Good stop. They're going to probably go for it here, though. Wow, they're really going to punt it. I really want to know why... Why he's on punt return. When I absolutely switched him off of there. You guys saw me switch him off on the depth chart screen, right? Before the season started. I don't want my star safety getting injured on a return where he's going to get like two yards. All right, here we go. Block, please. Nope, no block. Dang it. Really tough trying to set up blocking on returns. holding. Thanks, King. All the way back inside our own 10-yard line now. And Davis has a step on him. Got him again down the 40-yard line. Miami cruises against Temple. And Maryland beats Florida State. Love to see that. And we'll get four yards with Dalton. He's up to 73 yards already in the game with one touchdown. Give it back off to the fullback here, Mr. Garrett. And maybe a yard. Might have got to the 35, and he did not. kick a field goal there. Hurricane fan of the end? Absolutely, Marvin. Come on, man. A Florida State loss is a Miami Hurricane win. You know this. Oh. Oh, my goodness. He's open. Let's go. What a great play by Watson. Incredible. I'm going to have Webb go left on an out. He's wide open. Let's go, Webb. 
Oh, juking all the way to the five-yard line. Love that. Catches 25 yards for Orlando. And Dalton is going to be dropped at the one yard line. Looked like he was going to be able to get in there. Just couldn't quite inch his way. Let's give it off to Ballard. 100% in the red zone this season. Obviously, number one in the country. And Robbie Ballard, touchdown, Mississippi State. You know, we're really not handling these guys <laughs> like I thought we were going to. Just two touchdowns here in the first half. That was a good kick. All right. Not sure what our kicker's distance is going to be for for this season for the young fella. We might be able to make a 40-plus yarder. I don't really want to attempt it just yet, though. That 38-yarder we pushed to the right definitely had the distance for it. If we have to, I'll attempt like a 45-yarder. Uh-oh. No, you did not. Steve Kerr out here, almost returning a kickoff for a touchdown on us. NC State just got blanked 41 0. They were ranked. Not anymore. Oh my. What the heck was that play? That was really awkward. Field. Man, it'd be really nice to get a quick three and out after that great kick return. Come on, boys. Let's go. Really quick three and out. Kick return meant absolutely nothing. Warhawks looking to punt it away. Trying to bounce him away from that. There we go. We get it at the 20 yard line now. I don't know why they're booing right there, but I'm going to go play action. See if we can't hit a deep shot down the right sideline. pass and that is intended for I believe Webb. A little too much mustard on it, you know? And I could have swore we had running plays that are not draws. That must be high. Oh yeah, a halfback direct snap. No. Get that play out of my face. Hawkins, oh my goodness, I thought he was gone. Took a quick pass and almost took it the distance. Come on, Webb. Let's go, baby. To the 35. Wow, Southern Miss falling hard now. They were 31st before we beat them. They've now lost two straight. Let's try a screen pass. Problem with this is I, I don't remember how to throw the ball away. If it's not there. 
Take off. Get some positive yards with Watson using his legs. What the heck? That doesn't happen. Oh, now he's hurt or tired. His stamina is like 50. Cletus Pace in the ball game. Second time we've seen him this season. Let's go, Webb. Pace now two for two on the season with a touchdown. Third down and one coming up. Wow, that should have been an easy first down. Lyman got crushed though. Pace still in the ball game. No update yet on Watson. We got one on one left side with Hawkins. Throw it up to the end zone, Hawkins! Oh, and he can't come away with it. Uh-oh. Anderson wide open! Oh, come on, Cletus. That should have been a touchdown. Should have been easy money. They're down to 10, coming up. Let's go middle clear from the 24 yard line. Uh oh. Ah, dang it. That's unfortunate, guys. Well, we're going to try a field goal here. This will be a 45 yard attempt. It's kind of the range that I wanted to avoid, but we'll see what the young freshman kicker has in his leg. See if I can get the accuracy on it this time. We're going against the wind. Oh, I didn't get the accuracy. Dang it. I don't think he's got the leg for that. Hey, he might. All right, 14 to three as we head into the half. Definitely want to be up by more than we are right now. But we got more than double their yards. We haven't turned the ball over yet. A couple mistakes with two missed field goals for us. Uh, but that's just more so my fingers not working. Oh, oh, what a spin move that was. Oh my goodness. Get wrecked, scrub. Get wrecked. That was kind of crazy. We do have Watson back under center. And no blocking there. Wow. Perfectly timed blitz. Sandoval with five tackles in the ballgame. I'm going to try the quick slant play again. One where Hawkins. I don't think this is the exact one. But Hawkins almost broke it before. We got a man wide open. And Webb. Oh, he's gone. Touchdown, Bulldogs. Let's go. 63-yard touchdown pass for Napoleon Watson. Now we're cooking. Stick around after this game, guys. We're taking on LSU in game number four of season six of our Mississippi State Bulldogs dynasty in NCAA football 2003. Time to pull away from the mid-school. We're going to try, man. Still got to go out and try to play defense. 
again, you know, teams keep having some success on the ground against us, but I don't know if they're going to keep running the ball down 18 points. Oh my gracious. Moreno. <laughs> What's going on over there, buddy? Warhawks get a nice deep pass down the field. And Moreno gets hurtled by an Olympian, apparently. Oh, he's wide open. Come on, Moreno. You're getting cooked, son. You're getting beat like you stole something over here today. What the heck? I mean, this quarterback's just looking that way now. 81. Having himself a day. stop the freshman strong safety. Let's go rush zone. Oh, let's go! Singleton gets the pick! I don't even know his first name. Is that the freshman? One of our, our new faces on defense. Who would it be? Nope, that's the Richard sophomore, Earl Singleton. Let's go, Earl. Beautiful play. All right, let's try a draw play. I don't know. It's probably not going to work, but... Oh my. I had to spin as soon as I got the ball. So we're up to the tight end. And it's caught by Anderson. Up to the 48 yard line. Beautiful corner route by the young tight end. Oh, Dalton, brother. Two fumbles in the last two games for Mr. Dalton. Well... I think we're going to be giving Robbie Ballard some carries here going forward. Option. And that goes nowhere. John's tackle for a loss of one. Singleton, the man who had the interception, gets a nice tackle for a loss. Right now we're at 69 views. On the stream. Nice. Time to sit Dalton on the bench. Yeah. Oh my, what a tackle. <laughs> Oof. Who was that? May. Beautiful tackle. That was a freshman. They're down at 12 coming up. And that is going to go nowhere again. Turn punts in this game. Nobody blocks. I can't remember what works. Is it punt block where we actually have some time to run? Let's check it out. Well, we would if uh, he didn't kick it out of bounds. That was a really good punt. Just playing keep away. 
I think we're going to just rock with Ballard for this drive. Give Dalton a breather. Thank you, right guard, for doing nothing. Try to hit a post downfield to Davis. Alright, we gotta go Hawkins deep left side too. There's no safety over there. One on one coverage. And Hawkins has it. Oh my goodness. They can't hang with these big time receivers. They're just too tall. upset about that. Right guard, yeah, you prefer to agree. Oh, Marvin. <laughs> Come on, man. Oh, he's wide open. Orlando Webb. Easy money touchdown again. That is not who I was going to throw to, but I don't know what happened to the safety. Might have got caught up on the Davis route across the middle. Watson having a great game so far. 364 yards passing for this offense. I know Pace did complete at least one pass to help with those numbers. Extra point is up and it is good for Hayes. Salute, Jared. Appreciate you stopping by, buddy. If you're heading out, I hope you enjoy the rest of your Saturday night and the rest of your weekend, man. All right, 28 to 3 is the score. Nearing the fourth quarter now. Definitely going to put some backups in for the fourth quarter. And Grimes almost gets to the ball. But a nice catch by Sears on the corner route. John's not a bad day. 10 of 18, 170 yards. Had the one pick. But not doing too bad. He's going to take off here. Nice blocking downfield. And Woodard makes the stop after about a 9-yard pickup for John's. Down and one coming up. 113 left in the third quarter. And they're gonna get this first down easily with Murray up the middle. an eye on this man right here. That is our true freshman outside linebacker. Looking to have a great career here in Starkville. And that is well overthrown. Bouncing all the way towards the end zone. They're down 10. Coming up. So zone coverage. Let's 
screen. That was just a quick pass to the flats. That went nowhere. And we hold them on third down yet again. SEC action coming up next as we take on the LSU Tigers. Man, this punter is amazing. My goodness. Look at that. Got us out of the five yard line. I'm going to try something risky here. See if I can't hit one of these slant passes. Take that. Watson doing a great job breaking free from sack attempts. Get your fours up in the chat. We're on top 28 to 3 here against UL Monroe. And Dalton only gets a couple. We sat him that last drive. I think these are the route combinations that we've been beating them with Webb this game so far. We're going to give it a go. And nice catch by Davis at the 40-yard line. First down, Bulldogs. He's up to 100 yards. Hawkins close to 100 as well, 3 for 79. My goodness, Hawkins comes down with it. Watson was clobbered as he was trying to get rid of that ball. Somehow had enough arm strength to get it out there to the big receiver. And that gets Hawkins over 100 yards. So 100 yards receiving for three different wide receivers here in this ball game. And Ballard getting caught on the right guard. Been having issues at the right guard spot in this game. And I really just... I don't like that. And that was my fault. Tried to pull the trigger quick on that one, but hesitated. All right, they're down and long coming up. For Napoleon Watson and the offense for the Bulldogs. Throw it up top. And Roy comes down with it inside the 20 yard line. What a play. 100 yards passing to the left, middle, and to the right. Still going. Spins back to the inside. Picks up five. Man, that was not a good throw. I thought the receiver was going to break free there. Unfortunate. Third down and five coming up. Time to give it off to the fullback and reaches forward. Cannot pick up the first down. We're just going to kick the field goal here. Let me see if I can get the freshman some extra practice. Anytime I can practice kicking, I, I'm going to give it a go. We got this one with Hayes. Kick is up and good. 31 to 3. That was an 11 play. 87 yard drive took nearly three minutes off the clock. Man, he's going to take this out of the end zone, surprisingly. Why not? One of the 
things I love about 03 and 04, it, you know, it's really hard to get a big time blowout where you're putting up, you know, 70 points. Like, this is a blowout, and we're up 31 to 3. It's a little bit more difficult to get those high score games. Even though we've got, you know, nearly 500 passing yards, it doesn't feel like it. And huge hit for George Tyler, my goodness. Single coverage. Second down at five. Get him, boys. Let's go. I think that was May on the stop. Having none of that. No, that was Salazar, the middle linebacker. And we're going to blitz the true freshman, May, from that right outside linebacker spot on this play. And that play goes nowhere. They try the triple option with fullback. See if this punter can get another one inside the five yard line. He's been fantastic. Definitely the MVP for ULM. Let's go, Webb. Ref, you want to get out of the way? Thanks. Thanks, pal. And Webb up to the 26. I'm going to get Watson out of the ball game. Put pace in there. You know, he's got 56 speed, which it seems so much more than what Watson has. Watson, I think, has like a 45, was it? Not very quick, to say the least. guard this time is the problem. They want to go goal line. We're not going goal line, coach. Stop it. They're down in 12 coming up. Just over two minutes to go in the ball game. Open to the right side is Anderson, and the tight end comes down with it inside the 45-yard line of UL Monroe. And two or three yards for Ballard up the gut. Typical carry for him. Try a counter with Dalton. See if we can get set up, you know, the blocking enough for this to actually work. That would be beautiful. And he's to the outside. Look out. Here goes Dalton. And inside the 20-yard line. 230 yards on the season. Just one touchdown, though. If anything, we'll come away with a field goal on this drive as I practice my kicking. And there's Garrett. Oh, he gets crushed. Watson, player of the game, 17 of 20 for 436 yards, two touchdowns. Incredible. What a performance from him. Give it off to Ballard here. 
And Ballard inside the 10, or inside the five yard line. 23 first downs in the ball game. And we're gonna call a timeout, kick another field goal. Not trying to run up the score. Just trying to get better. Hayes on for the field goal. He's missed twice today, made one, and he has now made two. And that will do it for this game. 34-3 to is the final. Mississippi State Bulldogs are victorious over the UL Monroe Warhawks here in Starkville, Mississippi. 597 yards of offense today, 474 through the air. William Watson, 436 yards, breaks the school record. So we definitely found our offense, I think. We didn't have this in Season 5. You know, Watson was just getting crushed. I, I can't remember if he got hurt or not, but just wasn't cutting it. 436 yards for him, two touchdowns, no picks. He did get sacked twice. But I just I remember season five. It was really difficult to get anything going uh, for you know at all in any facet of the game on offense. But right now we got another hundred yard game rushing for for Dull and Webb, Hawkins and Davis. I mean, Webb was just open just all day. It seemed like two touchdowns, long of sixty three. I think he scored both those touchdowns on the same exact route today. Woodard, the freshman, strong safety, five tackles, led the team. Had seven tackles for a loss today. No sacks. One pick for Earl Singleton, though. Four deflections for the defense, and that is it. Rick Hayes missed two field goals. But, you know, we'll get better. All right, we are 3-0 and as we head into... SEC action. We're taking on LSU next. Man, this is where you know the real tough games are are going to happen. Look at the AA teams winning three games in a row. Central Michigan lost to one AA Southeast. One AA Southeast played a doubleheader. And they beat Akron 20 to 10. <laughs> One of the Northwest beats Utah State 17 to 7. Incredible stuff happening. Akron and uh, Central Michigan were both 2 and 0 going into that game. That's incredible. What in the world is going on in the MAC? Saving just takes forever in this game. Well, we're already at the uh, four-hour mark of today's stream. And I am not tired. We're doing good. All right, let's simulate the rest of week four. I mean, I can't believe some of these scores, though. Like, what the heck? One double A Southeast getting two dubs in a week. Get the heck out of here. The action just isn't what it used to be. Absolutely not, man. They're they're struggling. Alright, see what they're saying about Mr. Coach. Feels good to win, but there's always room for improvement. Oh, absolutely. I mean we had almost six hundred yards of offense and we didn't win by as much as we should have. 34 to 3. I mean, it's still a blowout, but could have been a little more, a little more lopsided. Should have been. Check out the top 25. See if we moved it all. Look at Syracuse getting a vote for first place. And we're still 25th. We are getting no love in the polls right now. Four teams that were not ranked just jump right in front of us. 
I mean, I understand Maryland jumping. You know, they just beat Florida State who was ranked ninth. But come on, man. All right, we'll simulate through week five and then get into SEC play. We're almost to 80 views on the stream. We're doing it. I'm going until we get 100, all right? I got to do it. Here we are. LSU, wow, they are having a rough season. What's going on with them? One and three. All right, we got to check out their schedule. See what the heck happened. Okay, they lost to Arizona, which, I mean, what? <laughs> and then they beat Troy State. Lost to Marshall by 24. And lost to Georgia by a touchdown. What's going on? <laughs> Jeez. That's insane. Well, uh, yeah, that's happening. So all we got left is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Yep, nine conference games coming up. Strap yourselves in, folks. LSU, Vanderbilt. Oh, no, Arkansas State is in there. Never mind. So eight conference games. It's still crazy. Like, what is going on with LSU? Oh, I gotta make sure the play-by-play -play is on because I I like to be able to hear that stuff. Just for the pregame, of course. All right. UTEP just beat somebody 69 to like not a lot. What happened? <laughs> oh my word. No, no, we're, we're not doing. Okay, that's what happened. Okay, the playbook is navy for them. No, my playbook should be Texas Tech. Why does it keep switching that? Alright, we're going all maroon. Let's get it! Well, four hours and seven minutes in, and I still haven't finished my Red Bull. Raining. Starkville, Mississippi, and Scott Field, the site for our football contest today. And we're going to have a little rain out there for today's game between the LSU Tigers and the Mississippi State Bulldogs. And here come the Bulldogs. Hello, everyone. I'm Brad Nessler with the rest of the gang, Lee Corso and Kirk Herbstreet, set to bring you more exciting football. As the bowl and national championship pictures start to take shape. This division Tigers sucks. Don't seem to match up too well in this one. Kirk, I'm not sure I like their chances very much. Oh, yeah, absolutely. I think you're exactly right about this. Mississippi State comes into this one with a good passing attack, and they have a difference maker lining up a wide receiver. In fact, Lee, I think he's one of the best receivers in all of college football. Let me tell you why I agree with you. Mississippi State has an advantage in this one, and that's their passing game. I look for them to get good protection, throw the football all over the place, and play like one of those all-star teams out there. Thanks, guys. Should be an exciting game. Now let's get down to midfield where they're ready for the coin toss. Oh, we're ready for the coin toss. Let's do it. You know what? Uh, do I want the ball first? I'm just going to defend that and let them pick. All right. Turn the boys off. Oh my goodness, you hear the thunder in here? What the heck? 
Rain delay. Even against 16 mile an hour winds, he gets that to the end zone. That's nice. Uh oh. Oh no. He hit him. Alright, LSU. Man, this weather is wild right now. Windy and raining, big oof for the passing game. Yeah, man, it's this is gonna be tough. I mean, they're coming out in big tight end formation, uh, big tight eye formation, I should say. Oh man, yeah, this could be a rough, rough game. It's gonna be real ugly, I think. There we go. Let's go, baby. Gonna come out with a shotgun. I'm gonna go nickel, cover two. We got the number one defense in the land. Let's go. Of course, we haven't really played anybody yet, so let's not get too excited. Ah, nice pass. What, are they just gonna try to run it on first and second and throw? Who are they? Carolina Panthers? That's a big quarterback. Get it, boys. Let's go. Alright, they're going four receivers again. Let's go cover three strong. Great play by Moreno as well. He broke off of his receiver that he was covering to come try to make a play on the ball. Just got there a split second too late. Poor me on the house catching straights. <laughs> yeah, well, be good, you know? Alright, the run defense is doing good. Let's figure out the pass defense, shall we? Goodness, Tyler almost gets the interception and a big collision out in the secondary as well. And that'll bring up third down and ten. Get the crowd crazy. No way he caught that. Oh my god. <laughs> what? That is wild. We're not going to get a replay of that. All right, let's take a uh, quick look into the replay booth here. Oh, my goodness. What a catch. I mean, that's ridiculous. Just full body extension, just laying out for it. You can't defend that. That's just a great effort. Also, their quarterback is, is humongous. Like, what the heck, man? Get him. That damn halfback direct snap. I can't stand it. And that looked like it bounced off the running back's helmet. Beautiful. Third down, 10 coming up from the 24 and a half yard line. No, no way. They're going to get this, I know it. Okay. Whew. Thought for sure somebody was going to come back and just be wide open. Fourth and 10, they're going to go for it? Huh? 
What the heck? They must not even have a kicker on their roster. Get the towel boy out here, you know, suiting up as kicker. Let's go, Tyler. Beautiful play. Did they just... I want to see if they even have a kicker. What do you guys got a kicker? I mean, he ain't that bad. I know he's a true freshman and all. Oh, come on. He could have made a field goal from there. That's crazy. They had no faith in that young man. And apparently, I forgot that this game... When you make an adjustment, it keeps the adjustment. So Pace was still the starting quarterback. Third string punter said no thank you for the chance to kick in the rain. I mean, I don't blame him, you know, but I think that kicker could have made that. Oh my god! What? What, what just happened? Dalton. Oh my god! That's not a great start. <laughs> that is not a great start. Dang! Just trying to get away from my own end zone. This is atrocious. This is a great start. Three plays, two fumbles. You gotta love the rain, guys. You gotta just really, really love it. Can't really complain too much. I mean, I mean they're playing in the rain too. And that was the easiest touchdown of all time. Okay. I just want to forget about that drive altogether. <laughs> oh, man. Okay, so hitting the reset button on the offense. Man, I'm not even getting like any tr kind of traction either. I might just have to go power runs all game long. yards. Okay, Baylor. Nice broken tackle there. He's not fast, but, I mean, he can break some tackles. Third in the country on uh, third downs. This is going to be a tough one, though. Just stack in the box. And Garrett gets pushed sideways. Doesn't pick it up. We're going to go for it. We're getting risky with it early in the ballgame. Why not? Got it. Let's go, Garrett. That's 
a face mask. Just a five yarder. We'll take it. Thunder is crazy loud. I got my headset on, so it's like right in my eardrum. I'm afraid to throw the ball at all. I mean, we, we can't block. I don't think we can block well enough in the rain. We can barely block well enough in, in good weather. Here we go. Here we go. Oh my goodness. Why did he stop blocking? Who is in at fullback? That's a tight end at fullback right now. That's Brooks. I don't know who the heck that is. He's dead. I know that. They're drawing a chalk outline around him right now as we speak. Might have to throw it here. Definitely throwing. And a drop. Oh boy. We're going to play the defensive battle. We're going to punt it away with White. That wasn't very good. That was not good. But Kramer makes a great play. I'll take that. Let's go defense. Play action. Get him. Okay, we'll take that. Loss of two or three yards. no offense. They don't have a whole lot of offense either. The weather is atrocious. And it's picked off by the freshman May. Let's go. First career pick for him. Blocking on that right side, though. I'm going to try to hit a tight end on a corner route. Actually, we got Davis one on one. And I can't get there. Dang it. Got him beat. Come on, Webb. Oh, no. He just missed him. 
The weather definitely has to be a factor right now. Alright, we have the wind with us. And the freshman kicker, Hayes, kick is up, and that is good. Very good kick. New long for him, 40 yards. Okay, seven to three. What an ugly, ugly game so far. I'm blitzing. Sorry, we got the crowd. I mean, they got to play through this terrible weather, too. But we don't have the crowd affecting us like they do. Get the half back. Come on, third down. Uh-oh. No way you pitched that. No way. Oh, my God. Come on, Grimes. Goodness gracious. That was unfortunate. No way. It <laughs> bounced off his helmet. Beautiful. Splits a couple linebackers now. And deflected away. Man, if Woodard actually turned around, he might have been able to pick that off. twice on that. A lot of missed tackles. Really unfortunate. Get him. Two missed tackles. Oh my goodness. Get him. Let's go. All right. Man, oh man. Wait, are they punting it? No way they're punting, right? Okay, field goal. I was going to say.
kick is up, and their freshman kicker misses it just short. Oh my goodness. Three and a half minutes to go. Let's get something going here. Oh my goodness, can't juke out one guy. Sick, dude. Now, what the heck am I going to run here? Guys don't have good footing, so the routes are off, the, you know, the timing's off and everything. Come on, Davis. Just can't get there. Man. Well, let the defense go back out. They've been doing pretty good. Come on, Stanton, please. Please. No, Stanton. Say it ain't so, brother. Oh, that is so annoying. for the defense to step it up again. This game is so intense, even though, like, not a whole lot is happening. Come on. Come on, old man. No. Oh, my goodness. I feel so bad for the defenders. You know, the guys on offense can just stop on a dime. Defenders are just flopping around the field like fish out of water. Get him! Ah, dang it. We have 21 yards of offense, guys. This is absolutely pathetic. All right. The only reason that they've got two touchdowns on the board right now is our fumble that we had and a big punt return. Their offense hasn't really moved the ball much, just like ours hasn't. We gotta get something going though. And that is definitely not gonna help us out. Come on. 
Oh my goodness. At least turn your head and look for the ball. throwing the ball we just we have to throw the ball no matter what the weather is doing right now we can't run it and we're down big now that's a good start for Webb okay we need a touchdown before the half we have to have it Come on, Davis. Got him. There we go. Let's go inside out. Really, Watson gets like the longest run of his career in this holding. Come on, King. It's your second holding call of the season already. Got him. Nice catch, Roy. That's a first down. Not a good, not a good throw there. Shouldn't have done that. Come on, bad throw. Third and goal. Uh, what do we do here? At back circle. Quick pass. No, that's the complete opposite of what we needed. Oh, my goodness gracious. Touchdown there. Time. We're down 21 to three at home to one and three LSU. Uh, just, just a very, very ugly half right there. We have three turnovers already. Two lost fumbles. We got a pick. Where? Oh man, we needed that touchdown big time. throwing it. We got to. Oh my 
my. The fans are uh, pretty impatient at the moment. I don't really blame them too much. Get beat up. Yeah, I know. So much pain. I cannot believe I caught that with him. Wow. <laughs> Watson got crushed. Look at that wobbler. The rain, the wind is just affecting everything for us and yeah, helping them out in the meantime with some of their big plays. Come on, Brown, you gotta catch that, brother. Like, I wanna be able to run the ball, but it's just not happening at the moment. There you go, Dalton. Okay, eight yards, running through the thunderstorm. We're definitely not out of this. We can make this happen. Come on, Garrett, push forward. Let's go. Taking a deep shot. Probably on the right. Maybe. That was pass interference. Let's go, uh, let's see. Tight end corners. Nice play down the field, and it doesn't even matter. Just shooting ourselves in the foot, just left and right. Good catch, Hawkins. Oh, my goodness. I thought he was going to miss that big time. <sighs> Ellis, you got me sweating right now, man. Definitely have to keep going. We got to try for a touchdown here because we're going against the wind. There you go, Webb. Let's go. web and dropped it. Dang. Alright, let's go back to the ground. Decent run. He didn't fumble it. We'll take it. down six.
Got him. Oh, Davis. No. Oh, man. I think we got to kick the field goal here. I really wanted a touchdown on this drive. But a field goal does make it a two-possession game again. If I make it, of course. Pick us up from the freshman, and it is good. 21 to 6. All right, we're clawing our way back in a little bit. That's not a good kickoff. Defense. Time for a takeaway. Dang Boys, get him. Now ain't the time to be giving up a big drive. Right. Not sure about that play call. They should have tossed that left side. to 83 views on the stream tonight. Appreciate everybody that's stopped by so far on this one. My comeback stream on the PS2 football games and our Mississippi State Bulldog Dynasty. Thank God he dropped that. Oh boy. I left my zone and I almost paid the price. All right, so we get a stop. That is crazy. That should have been a touchdown. Should have been game over. Okay. Now, we definitely need a touchdown. Go double flag. We got corners. I'm sending Webb deep from the slot. He's not open. Nobody's open. Okay, Davis, you dropped another one. That's the second drop in his last two targets. I'm not liking that. Come on, Hawkins. And he's going to drop it, too. Oh, I don't want to see him drop another ball. Posts? Got to have something here. There we go. I'll take that. Yeah, Watson, not having a great day, but we have to throw it no matter what. Okay. Good run after the catch for Dalton. Very nice. Single coverage left side with Davis. Dang, Watson.
Watson got crushed. It's all right. We'll take it. Five yards. There's no way he broke free and is that quick at a defensive end. He's open. Come on, Davis. Let's go. Inside the 10 yard line. We're in business, baby. Quarterback is not on the field. We got Cletus Pace in there. And Ballard up inside the five, down to the three yard line. Pretty good run for him. He's probably the best running back of the day so far. And hand it to him again. Ballard, touchdown, Mississippi State. Let's go. We're going to go for two here. Got to have it. Curl flats. All right, let's go. Down a touchdown. Beautiful. What a drive. That was a huge two-point conversion for us. Please tackle him. Two broken tackles. That is just unacceptable. Second left in the third quarter. Where in tarnation is he throwing that? Well, if you're still in the chat, keep your fours up. We're down 21-14 here at home to the LSU Tigers. We get the stop. Let's go. We're coming back. We're storming back. Good return by Webb. Try to run it a little bit. Great field position to start this one. Goodness, wide open. That rain is just killing our offense. We're going 
for it. Probably shouldn't. But we're doing it. Come on. Oh, late delayed blitz right there. I just killed that drive. takeaway. I mean, that would be tremendous. We haven't got one all game. Not that I can remember. Alright, third down. Six yards to go. I'm gonna blitz. Both outside linebackers are blitzing here. Let's go. The freshman. First career sack for him. He also had his first career pick in this game. That is right. I do remember that. Yeah, we're going to let that bounce. Please bounce into the end zone. Oh, boy. We're going to need a big, big drive here. Quarterback again is not on the field. I'm not sure if he keeps getting hurt or he's just tired or what. I have no idea what's happening. But we gotta go 95 yards to tie this bad boy up. Trying an option. This could be disastrous. Yeah, this could be terrible. All right, we'll take that. I had to run it the opposite way, but <laughs> whatever works, right? For it, got it. Risky. Oh my goodness. Man, that could have been crazy. Oh, come on, Webb. You're killing me, man. That was a perfect post route. I don't want to see him drop that again. Come on, man. Drops and just bad passes today. That's that's the name of this game right now. We got one-on-one -on -one coverage. Come on, Hawkins. I need you. And he dropped it. Man, that was a great mismatch there. Just couldn't execute it. I just picked the wrong play. Let's go, Ballard. Robbie. We're having no success on the left side of the field in throwing the ball. It's really unfortunate.
One on one. Davis. Got him. And he is going to go all the way to the one. Oh, my God. Man, nobody else is catching the ball today. I mean, Davis is having a great day. Man, less than two minutes to go. We got no business being in this game right now. And Dalton is going to punch it into the end zone. We're an extra point away from tying it up. Davis just keeping us in this game single-handedly. Everybody else dropping the ball, fumbling. Just not having a great time. Missed tackles all game long. Extra point from the freshman kicker is up, and it is good. 21 apiece. Nine plays, 95 yards, 221 off the clock. Hell of a drive. Now the defense has to step up again. Perfect kick. No shot of the return. Might hit the crossbar here. Yeah, it was very close. Great coverage downfield. They're just going to throw it out of bounds. Dyer, lucky to get rid of that one. Oh, my goodness. Oh, he should have had the pick. Who the heck is that? Oh, Stanton. Say it ain't so, buddy. You should have had that. Huge stop. We got a shot at winning the ball game right here. Come on, Orlando. Catch and run, buddy. Nice tackle. All right, we got it inside LSU territory. All we got to do is set up for the freshman to get a field goal. We're kicking with the wind. That's why the coin toss at the beginning of the game was so important. Oh, what a run by Dalton. Gets the first down. Great way to start this drive. Picks up maybe three yards. Not a great day for him. Had the crazy fumble on our, I think, our opening drive. I got this. I'm trying, B Dog. I'm really trying, man. And maybe got a yard on that one. Third and six. Oh, that's a face mask. Let's go. That's beautiful. makes this play call uh, pretty simple. Give it to the big man. Don't you dare fumble my football, Garrett. First down. Up to the 25. We've got 29 seconds left. I'd like to get a bit closer here. we got two timeouts left. I'm going to take one after this play, probably. Yep. They're going to give Sherman player of the game. It's not even over yet. To the end zone. 
And the freshman tight end gets it. Oh my god. Wow. That was our last time out though. I don't like the angle of this field goal. I don't like it, but we're gonna do it. I definitely called the timeout too quick on that. That's my bad. Hayes, freshman, on for the lead. I missed. I missed. No, I didn't. Oh my goodness, he almost hooked it. Woo! We got the lead. Five seconds to go. 21 unanswered points. Man, we're definitely squibbing this bad boy. It's about as good of a squib as you can get in this game. All right, they got time for one more play. I cannot believe we just came back and took the lead this late in the ball game. Let's go. Game over. Woohoo. Man, what a game. That was one of the ugliest contests I've ever seen. We should not have won that one. But we stormed back. I mean, the only time that they scored was off of two turnovers and a really good punt return. Other than that, their offense did not move the football well at all. We finally got it together for the most part. The guys stopped dropping the ball. They only had 170 yards of offense. We somehow threw for 306 on just 13 completions. I mean, that's <laughs> that was atrocious. Couldn't run the ball to save our lives. 7 of 16 on third down. But we didn't turn the ball over again in the second half, I believe. Crazy. Yeah, look at that second half. Shut them out. 21-nothing in the second half. Get wrecked, Tigers. Yeah, Watson, 12 of 30 with a pick. No touchdowns. Sack once, long of 62. Look at the rushing stats. My word. It was Kevin Davis, man. He, he kept the team afloat. <laughs> he really did. Look at the drops, though. He had three of them. We had six drops total. Seven tackles for a loss for the defense. Two sacks. Desmond and Corbin getting in there. Corbin gets his first career interception. We have four deflections. No forced fumbles. And Rick Hayes, he missed two field goals last game, but makes three of three, including the game winner in this one. And White did pretty well uh, punting the football as well. Two for 91, average of 45 and a half. Man, what a game. We should not have won that. But now LSU is... What are they, 1 and 4? What a rough start to their season, huh? Oh, uh, yes. Save all the things, please. Well, I show this beautiful graphic again. So nice, you know? I worked hard on that. It took me like an hour. Yeah, one more time. Why not? Beautiful.
Fresno State continues to just absolutely dominate. Always save. Yes, sir, Marvin. Got to do it, man. Don't trust the old PS2. Anything can happen, you know? Let's see, I think we got Vanderbilt next. Simulate the rest of this. Tennessee's still number one. I mean, they almost lost to Duke a couple weeks back, so that, that's pretty rough. Hey, we moved up three spots. We're just not getting much love today in the polls. Alright, we won four straight after our bowl loss at the end of Season 5. There's any uh, rankings or anything yet for? Oh, let's, let's look at our season stats. Watson doing pretty good. 1,220, uh, 29 yards, eight touchdowns, three picks, 60 percent. Sacked eight times though. Rushing, not so great. We're working on it. Receiving, everybody's got three touchdowns apiece. Blocking, no pancakes. Uh, lots of sacks allowed though. That's tough. True freshman Jared Woodard leads the team in tackles with 17. Incredible. Carl Salazar has 16. He did not play a single snap last season. George Tyler, 15 tackles. Of course, I am usering George Tyler. Earl Singleton, 14 tackles. And Bernard Moreno with 12. True freshman Corbin May has 9. Nobody with more than 3 tackles for a loss yet. We got five sacks on the season. Ten career sacks now for Desmond. We have D-tackle. We have six interceptions as a team. A bunch of deflections. Only one forced fumble for Ryan Atkins. And none recovered. Rick Hayes, 7 of 9 on the season, long of 40. Game winner, though. Uh, not, not the long, but he does have a game winner. And our punter is, I mean, we don't we don't talk about the net average, but regular average, that's pretty dang good, man. I'll take that. Kick return, we haven't really done anything on, or punt return as well. All right, we're going to get into it. This is not televised. Here's the matchup. We have the number 17 offense in the nation, number three passing attack, 108 uh, as far as the running game goes. Not even 100 yards per game. Uh, last game sure did not help us one bit. Turnover differential. We need to get some more takeaways if we want to compete with the big boys going forward. Let's look at Vanderbilt's schedule. See what they've done thus far. So we got to scroll for days over here. All right, Vandy, what do you got? Wow, they beat Auburn. Lost to Ole Miss to start the year. Ole Miss is 4-0, though. We'll see them later on in the year. They beat Auburn, who's 1-3. Lost to TCU 60-22. Almost beat Georgia Tech. All right. Decent games. I mean, their combined opponent record is 35-16, too. That, that's a tough, tough schedule right there. They got to face Tennessee as well. Course it's not televised. Listen, man. They had Jay Cutler that one time. <laughs> Come on, man. Alright, let's get it. We're doing it.
What is with the rain, man? Oh, goodness gracious. Well, I do think that we're going to be having a little bit more success on the ground against Vandy than we did against LSU, so we got that going for us. Come on, White. Of course, they're going to come out throwing. That's just what they do. I feel like we've had nothing but home games so far. Okay, Brown, whoever you are. Nice run for the quarterback. Hicks. Oh man, Kramer got beat really badly. Wow. I mean, that dude was fast. He's fast, fast. He's so fast, he makes fast people not look fast. All right, so 80-yard drive right off the bat here for Vandy. are always holding when I have a, a good return going. I like how it just keeps switching profiles. Oh man, I had Hawkins open. Again, the rain is not helping us. One of the worst defenses in the nation. I can't remember how many teams are in this game. It might be 117 actually. Come on man, somebody block for me. Davis, he's open, and he's got it. positive yards out of that one. I'm going to try a toss play. They don't really work in this game very well. But we're going to give it a go. See how terrible it is. Well, they're doing man coverage, at least with the corners. Uh, three yards, maybe. Let's go fullback blast. Tenth in the country on third downs, 51%. Not bad. Not bad at all. And Garrett, first down. Let's go. And 
a nice deflection. Man, I thought I thought I had the tight end there. I'm gonna switch this up to like kind of a flood. Never mind. <laughs> Man, they got in there really quick. And this holding. Hoffman, you are booty cheeks, man. Like, what are you doing, bro? He's open. Oh, what a catch and hit. Oh, my goodness. Jeez Louise. That was an impressive catch. I don't know how he held on to that. He got destroyed. Come on, Anderson. And can't get there. Quarterback did this really weird thing where he jumped back for some reason. No huddle. Why not? Wide open again. And dropped it. That's unfortunate. They're down and seven from the 19 yard line. Dang it, that, that should have been pass interference. They were all over Webb on that play. That's fine, we'll kick a field goal. Attempt one at least. Vandy and we're out of the top 25. I mean, if we lose to Vandy, we might as well just kiss the season goodbye, you know? That's going to go out of bounds. Still working on kicking with, you know, the middle of my thumb. Alright, let's go 4 3. Draw play. Oh no. Oh my goodness. I need my defense to wake up a little bit. Oh, 
Oh my word. I was just out of reach of that for the pick. I'm gonna blitz Woodard. See if the young fella can't get in there, make a play. Nice play, Grimes. Oh my goodness. Is he going to go on that? What was that play design? That was awful. Catch that. Please don't fumble. Oh, my goodness. I'll try draw play. Catch him off guard in the rain, maybe. I oh, broke a tackle up to the 30, at least. Get there. Oh, he dropped it. Man, drops are killing us these last couple games. There you go, Garrett. That's what I'm talking about, baby. First down. Play to Hawkins. I don't think I'm going to get this play off. No, oh, we did. And we probably shouldn't have. <laughs> oh my goodness. That is unfortunate. That's the end of the first quarter, though, and we are down 7 3 to Vanderbilt, of all teams. beat. Let's go, Davis. Hung on to that one. Come on, tight end. Get there. Come on, Anderson. Oh, just out of reach. He was a little bit faster. He would have got there. speed and Watson injures his head on the play that is not good that's really really unfortunate if he's down for a significant amount of time I don't think we can make a field goal from here. I'll try it though. It's gonna be a 48 yard attempt for the freshman. Really no wind at all. I don't think he's got the leg for this. I think 45 is probably the edge of his range. 
I didn't get the power on it. Got the accuracy. Yeah, I, th I think 45 is probably his long. Freshman showing out his third pick of the season. He leads the team in interceptions. And we don't even get a replay of this. You gotta be out of your mind. Oh man. Look at the concentration here. Thanks, that's mine. Man, what a play. Good lord. That was insane. Please, somebody block. Please. Nope, guess not. That's cool. And now Booth has injured his head. That's a big loss for Vandy. He's got five tackles on the day. Still no sign of Napoleon Watson. Looking like Cletus Pace time for the Bulldogs. For the tight end. And overthrown. I keep getting these one-on-one -on -one mismatches down the field with the tight ends. I just can't connect on the pass. Alright, third down and 11 coming up. Got double coverage on Hawkins, double coverage on Davis. Yeah, didn't get the playoff in time. That's all right. Let's go stretch. Try to hit the post up the middle. Brown. I'm gonna switch it other side. It's gonna go to Webb. Maybe not. Not a good play. Dang. Alright, we'll punt it away. White on for the punt. Come on, Stanton. Oh, couldn't get there. Dang it. Too much traffic to try to weave through. To, to get there to make a play on the ball. Get him, boys. We made it so he couldn't pitch the ball. Oh, they're going to go goal line here. Interesting call. snap goes nowhere that is what you love to see draw play to the fullback and he gets rocked. Oh my goodness. Alright, 
They're down nine. We just got to keep trusting our defense. I know the offense is struggling a bit. But the defense is hanging tough after that opening drive touchdown from Vandy. That's going nowhere. Let's go. Not a lot of offense in this ball game. Almost blocked that. I don't know if I blocked the kick in this series yet. I don't think I have. And no blocking. Cool. Another injury for Vandy. Looks like their corner. And they're just waiting for us to run the ball. Ten three in Army Navy game. Hey, I mean that's typical, you know. All right, one on one coverage here. Hawkins and it's picked off by Sweeney. Okay, cool. That was just an overthrow by Watson. Man, this, these rainy games are killing us right now. Back to back like this. Really affecting the offense a lot more than I would hope for. But again, it's also affecting our opponent, so I can't really complain too much. I'm just going to try to win another ugly game. No problemo. And there's a drop. North Texas all the way up to rank 16 in the country. Impressive. We can't even get past the top 20. Or into the top 20, rather. Grimes almost has the one-handed pick. I guys, I guys just don't believe in uh, using both hands for interceptions, you know. We prefer to go for the highlight. Oh, Sparks like the kind of game? Yeah, absolutely. And Woodard drops the interception. How many drop picks have we had in this ball game so far? Too many. I hit the kicker. That's unfortunate. Good stop by the defense, and I, I ruined it trying to go for a block punt, which would have been a game changer for us if I was able to succeed. And then Woodard gets mossed. Wide open, my goodness. Moreno got torched. And we're down two scores now to Vanderbilt. At home. All right, Moreno, make up for your your drive you just had. Let's 
Scoop and score by Army. Let's go. Wow, that was amazing. That was a great play. Good lordy. We're getting handled right now by Vandy. Not a dang thing is working on offense at the moment. You got Hawkins one on one left side. And he gets hit. And Hawkins comes down with it at the 48 yard line. Love to see that. That was a wobbler. My goodness. But Hawkins is just so much bigger than these other other guys on the field. These these DBs don't really stand a chance at at making a play on a jump pass or a jump ball. That pump fake got him. Come on, Davis. Oh, no. Come on, baby. Say it ain't so. He should have had that. That should have been an easy touchdown. To the tight end. Anderson comes down with that at the 30-yard line. Great corner out there for the freshman. yards on five catches for the season for the tight end. He's wide open, and Davis comes down with it at the 15-yard line. We are moving. Hasn't been a whole lot of thunder lately in the game. Open! Touchdown, Bulldogs. Let's go. Man, that seemed like it took forever for us to get in the end zone. Nearly the whole first half. Beautiful route by Davis. Can't run the ball in the rain, apparently. But we can throw it a little bit. Extra point up, and extra point good. 14 to 10 after a six play, 74 yard drive. Took a minute 29 off the clock for the Mississippi State Bulldogs. That's a bad kick. Dang it. It's all right, everything's fine. Again, I, I have no feeling in my fingertips for like the last year and a half, so I'm working on it. And incomplete. Woodard on the coverage there. Looks like it might have hit him in the back. I'd like to get the ball back again right here. Try to get a quick score before the half. Overthrow by a pretty big margin there. Right, let's go combo here. Combo zones. Uh oh. Let's go, George Tyler, baby! The user interception. Let's go. Concussion symptoms? Oh, my fingertips? No, I think I was told that it was uh, could be stress related. So you know, getting rid of stress is helping. I have a little bit of feeling in in my left fingertips on my left hand. All right, Webb, get this. Uh, okay, you didn't get it. That's tough. What do we want to do here? What do we want to do? We have timeouts. 
I'll try to hit the middle of the field quick. There's the thunder. Let's we can get somebody on a pump fake. He's open. Davis down to the 20. Timeout. Timeout. Thank you. Davis over 100 yards. Receiving with a touchdown today. Let me get a corner around here. Try to hit Webb. I'm gonna send Anderson on on a scene right there. Come on, Webb. No shot. Oh man. What a great play that was. Well, we're gonna be down going into the half, I guess. To Vanderbilt, 14 to 10. Unacceptable play here in the first half. Can't run the ball. Uh, having a hard time throwing it to our guys as well. Just really sloppy play here in the rain in Starkville. And that is the first half. 14 to 10. Vandy on top. Looking for their second win on the season. Second conference win as well. They beat Auburn. Come on, Dalton. Let's get it. Not a bad return. 27-yard line. I really want to try to get the ball going on the ground a little bit. Only 10 yards there in the first half. That's unacceptable. There you go, Ballard. Just trucking a defensive tackle. You love that. Pick up a five. For the sophomore. And nothing for the fullback. Maybe a yard. Maybe. Nope. Not a damn thing. Alright, they only got one safety deep. I'm sending my receivers deep. He's wide open, and Davis is gone. Touchdown, Bulldogs. Take the lead. 68-yard touchdown pass. Might have been the pump fake again that got the corner to bite. They also had the safety playing up in the box. Expecting the run. Well, let's take a look, see if the pump fake got him. Oh, wow, look at the corner. He's already stopping before the pump fake. That is just a blown coverage through and through. I mean, what happened there, Vandy? Not too often we're getting a touchdown where I can actually celebrate on the way into the end zone. Extra point from Hayes is up and good. There we go. This kickoff's going to stay in bounds. Let's go. Get him. All right. The return wasn't that exciting. We don't need a replay of that. 17-9 now. Maybe missed the two-point conversion. That's tough. Draw. And what a hit. Oh, my goodness. That was May. Freshman outside linebacker laying a boom stick on him. Oh my word. May again having himself a game. Flex on him, freshman. Alright, they got four receivers. Let's go nickel. Uh, we'll just go combo. I am covering the slot man over here on the left. And that is well overthrown. A 
Almost to 100 views on the stream tonight, fellas. Appreciate all the support. Seeing a lot of old names in the chat. Feels great. We'll be streaming again. Second down and 19 coming up. Try to get him with a post with Davis. Oh no, where'd the blocking go? Oh man. Third and 21 coming up. Davis is out there somewhere, right? That's as good as a punt. I'm okay with that pick. That's fine. Three picks today. Oh, well. Quarterback draw. I took the wrong angle, and Brown is apparently Michael Vick. Tim Tebow breaking tackles. That was ridiculous. Would really appreciate my guys not missing tackles. There we go. Like for the D-line to get in there and get some pressure on him. There we go. That's what I'm talking about. All right, quarterback spy, third and eight. We don't want him to take off and get this first down. I'll be furious. Oh, what a throw and catch by Oliver right there. My goodness, right on the sideline. I mean, you can't really defend that. Dang. That is unfortunate. That should have been a pick. Sorry, Salazar. We'll take the deflection. Wait, was he even on the field on that? Okay. The only thing I don't like about Nichols not having May on the field, that outside linebacker. Oh, fumble! Oh, no. We've only forced... That's our second forced fumble of the season. And again, we just can't recover it. Picked off again by Tyler. Let's go. Beautiful. The user interception, baby. Alright, let's get play action going here. I'm going to go Davis again because oh, nobody else wants to catch the ball in this game. He's open. Davis got him again inside the 35-yard line. He just keeps squeezing by the defenders and getting behind them. And having a heck of a game. We have no rushing yards, which is 
Oh my goodness, it's infuriating. He's open. Hawkins inside the 10 on the post route. Love to see it. And of course, Watson gets crushed again. My goodness. All right, who's going to be open? Who's it going to be? No way. Watson gets a rushing touchdown. Let's go. This man's got like 45 speed. Just blazing speed. Gets into the end zone for the touchdown. I'll take it. Next point up, and it is good from Hayes. a little bit better now. We're up by 10. Oh, no, he got beat. Woo. Luckily, luckily, he missed that throw. That could have been really bad for us. An army punt bounced backwards for like a 10 yard punt. Oh, that's unfortunate. <laughs> Not the first time that's happened though. And drop pass for Vandy over the middle. That was holding. Uh, not holding on to the ball, that's for sure. Alright, let's go three deep spy. caught it oh man I went for a diving interception I whiffed on that bad boy they have not thrown it on the left side of this field yet Moreno is all over it Brown is 6 of 21 both quarterbacks have thrown three interceptions on the night and a huge huge hit from May Toss play is gonna work. Come on, man. Y'all should know better than that. Six hours into the stream, folks. Uh oh. Oh boy, I'm covering two guys by myself. Thank goodness. Quarterbacks both having a rough night. But Watson does have 350 yards, so I'll take that. Uh, you know, in large part because of Davis just getting wide open behind the secondary all day. All right. Try to run the ball a little bit, shall we? Really, dude? You want to actually block somebody? That, that is your job. I guess not. All I have to do is hit one guy. And Dalton's going for at least ten. 
And of course they know I'm running it left side, naturally. Heck of a career for McNeil. 172 tackles, 11 sacks. Not bad. Not bad at all. But that will do it for the third quarter. Get your fours up in the chat. Can we hang on against the Vanderbilt Commodores here in Starkville? It's 24-14. Bulldogs on top. Again, getting open, but he fumbles this one away. Man, Vandy in really good field position to start this drive as Kirkland has injured his head on the play. And that's about the third or fourth player just this game to sustain a head injury. Rain affecting this game heavily here in this one. And there's another drop pass. I'm going to blitz May off of this left side here. Oh, Tyler, say it ain't so, brother. Absolutely trucked out of his shoes. Kirkland will return. Just a migraine headache, a.k.a. mild concussion symptoms. Oh, come on, Tyler. Two plays in a row, missing tackles. Dang. <laughs> when you play EA Sports video games, you got to control your temper. Yeah, I've been there, buddy. Not like that anymore, though. Just here for a good time. Go cover two man. Second down and ten. Six oh four left in the game. nearly has the pick inside the 10 yard line really good deflection by the corner nice hops they're down at 10 for Vandy and that is deflected away I'm not sure if it was Grimes or Tyler that got a hand on the ball they're gonna go for it though fourth down to 10 down 10 points with less than six minutes remaining in the ball game. And nice throw again to Oliver. Man, keeps beating him on those corner routes. Really tough to defend that, especially when it's a perfect throw. I feel like all three of his catches on the day are on corners. And the fullback gets the carry, dives, and just misses the end zone. get in this time. Touchdown Vandy. They close the gap. One score ball game again. 5.33 remaining in this one. Nine plays. 37 yards. 24-21. Vandy sticking around. 
Up to the 25 yard line. I'd really like to be able to run the ball, but I just can't do it. No matter how hard we try. And Garrett picks up about three on that one. Dalton breaking a couple tackles first down All right, we ran the ball a few times. Let's try to get something going with the passing Tight end is open and he's got it inside the 40-yard line of Vandy. That's a big-time pass Almost 300 yards passing on the right side of that field. To Webb on the corner route, and he tries to lay out for it. Can't hang on. And second down and 10 coming up. Four yards up the middle. I'll take that. Oh, Watson with the juke. <laughs> oh, if I'm that linebacker, I'm embarrassed. I'm going to the sideline and, and I'm hiding on the bench. Three yards up the gut. Oh, no way. That's the second time this season we've been picked off by a defensive lineman. I knew that was coming as soon as I saw that receiver right there. What a play. Bad, bad, Leroy Brown. Baddest man in the whole damn town. I love the ball physics in this game. Incredible. Twenty-eight, twenty-four. Vandy on top. Three oh eight remaining in the ball game. And this holding. Daryl Jones in the chat. What up, Daryl? Loved his, the dynasties. Appreciate it, man. I plan to do another team. Uh, not for 03. For 03, we're going to keep using Mississippi State. This is the team we started the channel with. This is another head injury. My goodness. The very first Dynasty video we ever did was Mississippi State. This is the same series. So we're just going to keep rocking with them. Eventually, I uh, will go back and do the other games that I haven't done yet. Oh, my goodness. 
So we haven't done a solo dynasty in 06 yet. 07. Let's see, we got the Miami Hurricanes death penalty dynasty in 08. We'll get back into that one eventually as well. But we'll play all the college games for sure. He's open. Hawkins, got him. All the way to the 41-yard line. And it's just two receivers today. Nobody else wants to do a dang thing. Sack and another fumble. I swear, man, if, if we lost that fumble, I would have lost my mind. Truly just incredible. And Moreno out for the rest of the game. Pinch nerve. Davis! And can't get there. Alright, they're down. 17. Go corner. Rough game for Watson. Four picks. He's got 438 yards passing, though. One on one. Can't get there. Fourth down. And 17 to go. Let's see. We punt this for sure. Unfortunately. Thought you saw all the Mississippi State Dynasty? Well, we brought it back, baby. Aw, oh, that was not good. Dang it. Man, if that hit it like the five, that would have been great. Scoreboard say fourth and seventeen right there. That was kind of crazy. All right, second and nine now. Trying to save our timeouts. Good tackle. All right, we'll take this timeout. boys need to stop oh thank goodness man he was wide open look at the rain just causing all these incompletions and interceptions all right we got two timeouts left I believe 122 to go in the ball game Forty-five yard line, plenty of time. Definitely been a rough go of it in this one, in this contest. We're just gonna have to keep going to our playmakers, though. Davis has been killing it all game long. Who's it gonna be? Nobody. Just dive. I didn't get out of bounds, that's okay. Just don't panic. There you go, Brown. There you go, Brown. Okay, Brown. What's up, baby? I think it's the first time we saw him all game. Davis, player of the game. Nine catches, 242 yards, two touchdowns. 
game's not even over yet. That last play was kind of crazy. He didn't get out of bounds? No way. Got him. Down to one. Beautiful post route. Come on, get into the line, please. Please. Ballard! Touchdown, Bulldogs! Let's go! What a drive. Robbie Ballard with the potential game-winning touchdown. And the crowd goes crazy. What a drive from Napoleon Watson, our fearless sophomore quarterback. Extra point is up, and it is good. 31 to 28. Now, Vandy does have a crazy touchdown pass in this game already off a of deflection. So hopefully no more shenanigans from them. Alright, that kneel down took one second off the clock. Let's go defense. Oh my goodness, man. I, <laughs> I swear, man. I thought for sure that he was going to deflect that right back to the wide receiver. That would have been so wild. They're going to get one more play. No, they do not get the timeout. That is going to do it. We are victorious. 31 to 28 in a nail biter. My goodness gracious. What a sloppy, ugly game that was. I mean, the crowd isn't even really that excited. Maybe they're more excited to just get out of this rain and this huge thunderstorm that we've had for two straight weeks here in Starkville, Mississippi. 489 yards passing for Mr. Napoleon Watson. 262 yards receiving for Kevin Davis. Almost had the game-winning touchdown there. Tagging up the one-yard line. Robbie Ballard gets the game-winning touchdown run on the ground. With 533 yards of offense. We're slinging it, man. We can't block for Watson, though. We can't run. Five turnovers is crazy. Four picks. Whew. But we also picked them off quite a few times, so almost evened out in the end. Yeah, look at this. Can't run the ball at all. My goodness. Only four people caught passes. I think we threw it to Webb like four or five times. Just couldn't connect to him uh, on corner routes. Just could not get the ball out to him. And the Brown, the senior, coming through in the clutch with a 31-yard catch on that drive. That ended up helping us win it. Five tackles for a loss today for the defense. No sacks. Three picks, though. George Tyler and Jared Woodard uh, had interceptions. Tyler had two. Woodard was one. And look at the deflection. Three, six, nine. Damn, she fine. Twelve deflections for the defense as a whole. Desmond gets forced fumble. Can't recover a fumble, though. Can't do that. And Rick Hayes, the freshman kicker, missed one field goal today. Just, uh, just way out of range for him. Just couldn't quite get enough power into it. save it and I think we're going to end the stream there. We are what the heck is our record now? 5-0? and oh?
Yes, sir. We are 5-0. and oh. And I think we have a bye week coming up. But that is going to be it for my comeback stream. Hopefully you guys enjoyed it. I know I did. Really glad that you know I was able to get this this computer and and bring some more football content to you guys because it's been a long damn time and I sure have missed it and I've missed our bulldogs that started this channel out helped us reach a thousand subscribers and we're gonna continue it for as long as I damn well please but hopefully you guys enjoyed it if you haven't already please slap the like button subscribe if you're new and I. Catch y'all on the next one. Take it easy, guys.